Oh my god, that was loud. Hey everybody, welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. I hope you all are doing great today. I'm doing amazing. And we are going to go ahead and we're going to unlock and fly them both the Hippogriff and the Thestral Mounts. Which I, I just figured out how to do that not just recently. Yesterday I spent a bunch of hours in this game. And we are going to have a good time, I hope. Let me say hello to everybody who showed up uh, before the live stream. Hey Andrea, how you doing? Ronald Thompson, good to see you. Uh, Article 5 and Brooklyn Bella. You all said something before the chat, uh, start, before we started, and so you get this chat out. I don't have a picture of Zeus today because I had to redo my whole OBS. So hopefully this is not going to freeze on us. But if we do freeze, just type in HOLD in caps. H-O-L-D. HOLD. If I've frozen and I didn't notice, let me know, and we'll go ahead and, and I, will, I will restart OBS, okay? My, you know, my online broadcasting system. So um, it, it, it's been having the hiccups lately, so we're going to have to just go as we go. So we're level 21 right now. I have a couple of things I want to show you in my vivarium look. I went out. I so told you I, I spent a couple of hours yesterday. I caught some new creatures. You guys can see. Look at this. I got a Duraclaw, a Duraclaw, a Duracall, and we have the Neasles now. I got the big kitty cats. I think I went back and I, 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 so right here. Let's go to H. So I've got um, I've got two moon calves now. I got a male and a female. I got a breeding pair of uh, giant purple toads. We have two Neasles and two Dura uh, Dura uh, calls. I also have the uh, Puff Skeins, and we have the Jobber Nulls. I do have a Thestral, and we have the uh, we, uh, well, these Dura Claws are going to have to be sold. Now, this is the thing about this uh, about your Vivarium guys is that the am I shouting? I'm shouting. I'm sorry. Is um you can only have twelve beasts in a Vivarium at a time. But you can only have four species, okay? Now, yesterday in the live stream, um, the um, there were people that were saying, they were trying to tell me, you can only have four, trade them out, trade them out. I didn't want to trade them out. I understood. I guess I didn't make that clear. It was my fault. You can only have four species in a vivarium at any one time. Now, the, that, that's the bad news. The good news is there are more vivariums you can get so you can have more beasts, Okay. And there are only 12 beasts to begin with, so, um, uh, no, 13. There are 13 beasts you can collect. Um, I've collected uh, one, two, four, five, six of them, seven of them. So we have five more to get. Um, but that's, I just wanted to show you the vivarium. I can collect this, though. Pick that up, okay. And you, so you can just do that right from your, right from your, um, your, uh, inventory here if i go here i go okay i have to okay i gotta feed and brush this guy because he needs he needs he needs some work here so let's go um where's my brush there's my brush i'm gonna brush him and i don't need to feed him really i'm gonna oh i gave the cat some food I'll give you some food too bud i don't need to do that because we have the um the feeder right here which automatically feeds them and that, that, that is going to be, um, if you go into your conjuration, beast items. So this is a beast feeder. It only costs eight moonstone to make. It automatically feeds them. I, I, I want to go buy the breeding pen and the beast toy box uh, later on, but not right now. Um, and then, let's see, we, all, we have a bunch of outdoor items that we've unlocked, uh, which we can make things. So I made, hang on, actually, this one right here, I wanted to see what it would do. This is the Billywig Hive. It doesn't seem to do anything. It's basically a, a beehive. But it doesn't really do anything, I don't think. I thought I was going to be able to get some honey or something out of it. But it didn't really do anything when I, when, I, um, when, I, when I put it down. So, it looks cool. That's all it is. It's just ornamental. Anyway, so, we're going to go ahead and head on out. Oh, thanks, Pickle. You'll see you later. Um, so anyway, the reason I didn't want to get rid of the, um, the other creatures is because when I upgrade, see, I need Nifflers. 
Um, but I needed, uh, what was it I needed? There was a, there was, there was uh, something I needed. It was the, let me go back out here right quick. We're going to get on, on this, on this quest in a minute, but let me go ahead and show you. Hang on. I got to go out here to be able to do it. So, so if I manage my beasts, so yeah, the, uh, I needed puff skein fur for the first level of stuff. And then you need deer, uh, deer claw call fe feathers for the next level. So I was, I was trying to get, um, as much fur as I could yesterday, which is why I didn't trade out the Thestral. We can trade out the Thestral now, though. I can pull... We can pull these out. Right now. And now I only have three species, so now I can go ahead and I can add the Thestral. There's the Thestral right there. Oh! Interact with him. Hang on. Let's go ahead. We're going to give him a little, a little brush. So this, this is one of the mounts I'm going to have today. I can't use this guy as a mount, I don't think. Aw. Let's feed him. Oh, he still wants to be brushed? You're usually like a big puppy dog, aren't you? Now, can I feed you? There you go, buddy. And now, I, I get 23 minutes before I can, um, I can get a, 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 a hair from him. We'll leave him there for now. That's fine. Um, but I want to double check right quick. Make sure I'm not going to sell the wrong thing. So I'm going to want to keep... Actually, I'm going to pull him back out. Because if I don't... Then I'll forget. I'll off to you. So I need a male and a female. Because this is the only uh, Thestral I've got. So uh, the deer claw call uh, male. And then the female. Doesn't really matter which one. No, that one's complete. Alright, so these guys are going to sell these two. We're not going to sell our other critters, but we're going to sell these two, the deer claws. There we go. So we're good. Dick thinks you should be proud of all the potions you brewed. Oh, you know what? D oh, by the way, so um, so I I got myself a venomous uh, uh, ten uh, tentacula. I went ahead and bought that. We have that uh, shrivel fig, flaxweed. We've got um, a knot grass. We've got a uh, mellow sweet. Um, didn't any leaves, but I went ahead and I changed the mandrakes up. So I've got two mandrakes here. And we have plenty of didn't We really do. So what we're going to do is I hit hold tab down. I've got eight mandrakes. I only have one venomous uh, tenacula. You, only, you can only get one per. I, I need to get some fertilizer. It'll double it if I get fertilizer. Takes 15 minutes for that. All right, let's go. So here's the thing. Let me go ahead and just let me. Let me. We have to go to the high. We have to do the high keep quest, and to do that, I'm gonna have to um, complete gar uh, garlic's assignment quest, which I've been ignoring. So I don't know what 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 that. Has. No, I didn't want to do that. That was a mistake. Anyway, are we done? Hit escape. So, we need to go to uh, challenges. Is it challenges? No, 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 no. It's the journal. So, right here, these are the uh, professor's um, assignments, which we need to do to be able to get new spells, okay? We've got a prof Professor Onai's assignment for uh, Descendo. We've got, um, we've got uh, Sharp's assignments, or sh uh, Sharp number two for Defendo. Aristo Momentum for Madame uh, Kagawa's. And uh, we got Ma uh, Professor Garlic's Wingardium Leviosa. Now, I've already completed G Garlic's assignment, so I'm going to have to go there and get Wingardium Leviosa, which will allow me to forward my quest to go and get my, my Hippogriff, and, and then that'll also unlock my um, the other guy. The Thestral. So, all right, so we're going to have to go there. We're going to go M. And, well, I thought I had it. Well, where is she? Hang tight. Journal. Uh, herbology class. 
Okay, so we have to go to the map. And the herbology class is... Is it Great Hall? No. I don't know where it is. It should be lo it should be locked. Oh, it should be showing me. It's not. What's up, Tui? How you doing, man? Good to see you, buddy. As soon as this, un uh, this opens. Well, you'd have to have them so. Indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Here we go. Here it is. All right. So I'll hit B, and that'll show me where I gotta be. Okay, so it's going to take a minute. Here we go. All right. What was that? Oh, during the day, it's nighttime. I'm going to wait till nighttime or till day, till daytime. That's okay, though. We'll get we'll get where we got to be. That froze. But don't be shy, for I can't wait to watch you try. <laughs> One of the most colorful ghosts. All right, let's go down here. I forget where herbology class is, but here. Oh, this is it right here. All right, so this, so the main hall. Is this the main hall? Yeah, this is the main hall. So we just have to go to the main hall. Hang on, I saw something. Revelio. The field guide. Um, while we're waiting on the daytime, let's go ahead and let's do this. Oh no, it's it's wait, it's not that. It's um. Lumos. Lumos. That spot must be a clue. All right, I so if look you look around in case it's nearby. Yeah, so if you don't know um, how to uh, do that, do Lumos and then light that up. It'll show you where the moth is, but you don't necessarily need that after I mean, after that. You just hit Revelio and look for the blue moth. There it is. He's a flapping his wings right there. And I'll do a little how a little quick how to on that later on today. I've got a how to ready to go. This looks like the location from the painting. And then once you have the moth, you just so go uh, uh, Lumio. Lumo? Lumio. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Yep. There we go. And then you just use a, a simple cast to throw him into the into the mirror. Ha. I knew there was a connection. I should tell Lenora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. And then you get a, a field guide uh, uh, page. So. Now, I don't think she's going to let me in, because I don't think it's time yet. Oh, maybe. Let's see, go down here. I might be able to wait till morning. It might let me. Rebellion. See if there's anything in here. I don't think there, there is. Now, I, I've, I've already been here. I've already been here, so... Uh, I think it's gonna eat my face. Professor, what made you want to teach herbology? How lovely of you to ask. I've always had an affinity for greenery, so this situation is a bit of a dream come true. After graduation, I was thrilled to be asked to step in for my old herbology professor. He'd had a slight accident, you see. Oh dear. Shame for him, but it worked out well for you. Hmm. Well, he never cared. 
really cared for the plants and they could sense it. Oh, you'd be surprised how perceptive a plant can be. Is that wrong? At any rate, the trouble began one day when he cut into a Wigan tree. Unfortunately for him, its leaves were hiding a bow truckle. You may recall the marvellous creatures that resemble a twig. The little beast gouged the professor's eyes quite fiercely. A terrifying, I'd imagine. Uh, likely for the professor, too. And that's when you took over as the herbology professor? Well, not quite. After three weeks at St. Mungo's, my predecessor regained a tiny bit of his eyesight. He insisted on returning to the greenhouse. Within a week, he had, he claims by accident, kicked a Chinese chomping cabbage. So it was back to St. Mungo's for him. Oh. What a string of bad luck. Hmm. Well, I felt awful for him, but I dare say I felt a bit more sympathy for the cabbage. Upon his discharge from the hospital, his indifference to plants had turned to utter disdain. He lost what little patience he had left with a particularly temperamental venomous tentacula and... Well, his resulting leave of absence continues to this day. Uh, Tui, I don't know. Uh, maybe. Uh, I'll have to look. After, after stream, okay? I'm glad everything worked out as it did and that you're the herbology professor now. Very kind of you to say. I do love these gardens and helping my students grow. Huh. Lovely speaking with you. Have a wonderful day. Oh, and remember, be kind to your Wigan trees. She looks about 18, right? Am I wrong? She looks really young to be a professor. Revelio. Hmm. Well, I planted that. You know what? We can put something else in there. Let's put a... Put a mallow sweet in there. That's my, that's my, my pot. Um, is there no way out of here? Besides the, the, the stairs? I thought there was a second way out. Well, we gotta wait till morning, which kind of sucks for me. I should I should have prepared better. It's my bad. Uh, nothing. Rebellion. There's a lock here. We could unlock this. It's locked. Lock locked. Like you can't even get into it locked. Oh. Okay. Well, in that case, been, um, I'm going to go, where is it? I saw a statue, I thought, that I wanted to check out. Oh, wait, is there a door we can open? Hang on. Have I not opened this door? All right, cool. Let's go ahead and go with, um, let's see. Okay, so crab and hydra. So that's going to be, that's nine. And the crab is eight, seven, six, five. Nine and five are 14. So we need a three, zero, one, two, three. So the three headed um, for the double, the three headed snake or the three headed uh, serpent. That's it right there. And then the other one. Uh, 21, so 11, and the dragon, which is 2, that's 13, nine? hang on, no, it's the lizard, well, that didn't work, spider? There it is. Cool. My math was off. Solar protection, spectacles, and three-seater sofa. Okay, cool. 
that's all random whenever you get in there. So let's go ahead and go with these uh, uh, face wear. That's going to be better. But you know what? I've got increased damage with Incendio on, on these goggles. So, ooh, that's only two better. So we'll wait. Oh, I cannot upgrade them at all? Oh, we'll sell those then. If I can't upgrade them, I don't care. Oh, the chest with the eyeball. You know, yeah, 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 yeah. I did see that, Tui. Yeah, I already knew, dude. I'm. Yeah, no, yeah. I mean, you, you were watching some old stuff from the, the first day. I appreciate you watching the old stuff. I do. Yeah, we already know how to do that. Yes, I did see that. You're right. Yeah. What is that? Rebellion. What is this? I mean, there's a there's a statue I was looking for. If I can get to it. Alohomora. Yeah, I need to go back during the day, though. Oh, wait, it's, it's getting light. We might be good. Let's see. Here we go. Imagine how inconvenient travel was before. Tui, thank you for that super chat, buddy. Money, money, money for the eyeball chest. Thanks, buddy. I appreciate you, man. Ah, to have a job that you love. Oh, wonderful to see you again. I've completed my assignments, Professor. Pleased to hear it. Professor Weasley will be too. I'll be sure to let her know how well you're coming along. Thank you, Professor. Professor Hecate tells me she taught you Levioso, so you should be ready for a more advanced levitation charm. Wingardium Leviosa requires a bit of concentration and a nice graceful wand movement. Let's see you try your hand at it. Let's go. Here we go. Correctly, so we, we got space right, left, space F. Sword. Okay, so and I, when I say right or left, I mean right click or left click. So, and you got you, you and you're gonna be chased by that red. So, space right, left. Come on! Oh, I yelled, sorry. Got it. All right, Wingardium Leviosa. It's Leviosa, not Leviosa. Now I can just not only levitate them, but I can move objects. See? So this is really super important. Um, and well done! Feel free to practice Wingardium Leviosa here in the greenhouse. I've set some crates out for you in the next room. Oh, in this room too. But okay, so we're gonna go uh, T for our spells. And instead of, uh, let's see, it's Leviosa. Where's the Wingardium Leviosa? There it is. So we're gonna move, we don't want the other one anymore. We don't care about that. <laughs> So this is going to be able to allow me to pick it up. You can move this around too. You hit the same button to stop it as you do to move it. So, and I think 
Nope, I thought I was gonna be able to. I thought I was gonna raise it up further, but. Okay, there's no there's no prompt for me to do anything else, so we're gonna get out of here. Oh, hello. Illustrious cloak. There's more stuff I can sell. Making money in this game is not as easy as but somebody might make you think. Let's go ahead and uh, check, check our journal right quick. Now I've unlocked the uh, I, I've, I've I've completed uh, Professor Garlic's assignment and I've uh, unlocked unlocked and we're going to Leviosa. I have to go find Natty now. This is what we got to do. We got to find Natty. Wherever she is. Sebastian, no. We're, it's the high keep quest is what we're looking for, but I got to find Natty. Natty is, um, where is she? Hang on one second here. Give me a second, guys. I apologize. Um... I gotta find a fall, a fall Barton Castle. Hang on, I gotta look up where Fall Barton Castle is. Bear with me. Yeah, this is... Bear with me one second, guys. I'm Googling. I might have to wait for an owl, maybe. Nope. Hang tight, I got it. Alright, hang tight. I got it. I think I got it. Map. So, I need to be over here. Let's, I'm going to have to fly there, I think. So we want to be... It's going to be right in between here. I haven't been there yet. So we're going to go there. But let me go ahead and let me let me use uh, that fast travel. We'll get on our broom and we'll head over there. Should work, I think. Resource indeed, your field guide. 
I'm most pleased to be included. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, and the reason that I was having a hard time uh, the other day with getting on my broom is you have to hold down the tab key and then press three. I was trying to do both at the same time. So, we're headed this way. Rebellion. That must be the castle right there. Nope. Sure isn't. I gotta unlock this so. This looks intriguing. Yep. It's like a place right out of a storybook. Now, this Merlin trial might be where I'm like. Trial? Hang on. Let's do this Merlin trial right quick. of them. I heard it. Thought. No. Went back up. So I'm going to have to do more than one here. Um, where are they all? Oh, I see. There's one right there. There's two of them. Where's the third one? It'd be a third one or a fourth one, right? Within the time allotted? Hang on, let me get on my broom. So we've got this one, that one. Where's the next one? Oh, there's one right there. All right, so I'm going to have to sit right here, I guess. I think. I mean, un unavailable right now, dude. Come on, let me down. Oh. So it might just be three. Come on, go! Damn it, I missed it. Oh. All right, well, we're definitely going to have to... Uh, we're going to have to... Well, this is not easy. Which is cool, but... Oh, wait, 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 wait. There, is that it? This might be where I need to be. There. There. There, I think that's it. Confirm. These Merlin trials won't get the best of me. Got it. Cool. Right, well, let's go down here.
There she is. Said that travel broadens the mind. You were there. Can you help me? Oh wait, that's not her. Shit. I could help you, but I'm not going to. Look at my map. Is this wor uh, public opinion? Is this game worth sixty bucks? I mean, Silva. I mean, you can you can ask. I mean, so far I've had a lot of fun. There's Paul Barton Castle. That's where I gotta be. All right, so this is where we have to be. I think. Yeah. Abandoned long ago, no doubt. Whoa, hang tight. What's a crest over here? Hey, Ian. So, oh, this is not a house. This is a this is a centaur castle. How would you like to learn the knockback jinx flipendo? Once you've completed the necessary tasks, come and find me in the greenhouse. Okay, garlic. Oh, I'll pet the cat. Why not? Is it worth sixty bucks to pet a cat? Maybe. Oh, why you no pet me anymore? Pet me some more. Oh, nice we. to see you, my young friend. There we go. All right, so I don't see her, and. There should be a golden circle where I can I can start the quest, but I don't see it. There's supposed to be a golden circle. Revelio. Leeches. What's this? Hang on. I mean, I could use this guy. Oh, I see. Hang tight. We got an issue here. That is definitely, okay, this is fine for moving stuff around, but to, to, to levitate them, to actually just levitate them, you need this. That's why I need that back where I was. Um, yeah. I do need that. Let me open. You're gonna be pissed. Come on. There it is. <laughs> now we're gonna get out of here. I have a ton of potions, so I don't really care. You come after me? Now, I might be able to do this. Now, I saw this on a video. Yeah, I've been doing my research. If we go here. I can find something I can, I can lift. I don't know if there's any stones or anything like that. Um... I don't see any stones. 
No. What's this? Don't you tongue whip me, boy. been messing with this kid. A lot I could have done with it, but... What's this? What was that? Anyway, let's go ahead and go over here to this window. Oh, I see you over there. Come on, let me, oh man, there it is. Rebellion. Oh, I need my purple mushrooms, man. Oh wait, okay, so you need whoa 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 You need Confringo to get through here. Confringo It's gonna hurt me. Ow, ow, ow. Rebellion. Oh, come on, let me through. Okay. Through here? What was this? Hang on. Rebellion. Nope. Okay. We come through this way? I think we came through this way. Let me go that way. We're going to get this, guys. I'm getting my mounts. I'm tired of uh, walking around out, uh, flying in a broom. You know, what do you uh, have in store for me this time? Let's grab these eggs. Okay. This is weird. Well, I'm not sure. Do you guys know? Accio. Oh, you want Accio? Really? Is there another lantern over here? What are we doing? Maybe I won't. Light, you think? Lumio? Oops, my bad. Lumos. Oh. I see. But to where? Oh, to these? I see. I get it. Am 
Might be a little slow on the uptake, but I got it. Where's the next one? Okay, wait, is there more? Lumos. Hmm. There's more bugs in the hole? Is there really? Oh, there are. Gotcha, gotcha. Roger, Dodger. Well, now my issue is I can't find uh, the girl I'm looking for, um, Natty. Lived here, I wonder. If we're down in here, maybe we'll find her. <laughs> what was that? I don't want always giving them dull tasks. Poachers, huh? Catch me, boy. What have you done? I killed your dog. That's what it did. Who are you, John Wick? Over poaching. There's enough beast flesh. It was funny. <laughs> oh. The beasts are safe now. There we go. The beasts are safe now. So, where's Natty at, dude? She should be right here.
Does anybody know? I thought I knew, but I guess I don't. Rebellion. Let's go map right quick. Let's go journal, actually. I should be able to track people. Natty, where you at, Natty? Nelly, Alby, Lenora, it's a high keep quest if I can find it, I thought I had it man, hang tight, it should be right here. So my information is, looks like, yeah, okay, so there, there, there are things that are people tell, are talking about that are not true. I'm really bummed about that. Um, maybe I have to go and, and do uh, garlic's. Assignment two. Maybe. That might be it. Hang tight. Unless you guys know um, of something that I'm, I'm missing. In which case, speak up, please. I'm going to head out. We're going to make this happen today, guys. Actually, I don't even need that. We can go here. I don't have to fly. I can just go straight to Hogwarts. All right. Flux weeds right here. And then acquire all three combat plants and use them simultaneously. So that would be the uh, the Chinese chopping cabbage, the venomous tenacula, uh, and the uh, mandrake, which I have them all. You just join the stream, you don't know? Yeah, yeah. That's fine. Um, so I'm going to use all of these. I don't need to do use them in battle. Just use them. So. Tenocula lasts a lot longer than anything else. So let me go ahead and do that. So we'll go ahead and tab. And then we will use the chomping cabbages. And then I will use the mandrake. Here we go. I gotta do now is go back to uh, Special Garlic, but I want to go ahead and grab this though. The Tenacula is not bad. Flux weed, uh, let's see, no. I'm gonna, I'm gonna collect everything I've got. I'm growing everything right now, so. And Drake's. And we've got 21 potions left, so we're good. So go back to Professor Garlic. Back to the main hall, or the great hall. Hello.
Okay, so. Hmm, okay, so. Wait, where the hell am I? did what you wanted me to do. Give me this new spell. <laughs> Ooh, squishy. What? What? That's a, That's a hybrid. I hear you. I finished the activities you assigned me, Professor Garlic. Wonderful. I hope you gained a greater appreciation for the flora in our lives. I am forever enraptured by it. Just yesterday, I spent hours pruning my self fertilizing shrubs and flutterby bushes. Didn't realize how long I'd been at it until the sun began to set. Well, if there's one thing I love to see more than my plants thriving, it's one of my students doing the same. Now, ready to learn flippendo? Chin up, keep a light grip, and it's all in the wrist. <laughs> Let's see you give it a go. <laughs> you will want to focus with this spell. Yeah. Nothing as mortifying as knocking back a colleague when all you wanted to do was move a few pots. Okay. Um... Space F right space space. Wonderfully done. If you'd like to practice a bit more, you're welcome to do so here in the greenhouse. Just sure, flipendo. What does it do though? Flips objects and enemies upwards and backwards. With a short cooldown, it's excellent for setting up and uh, extending juggles. Uh, okay. Um, oh, it just flips them upside down. All right, that's fine. Uh, we'll go... There, I guess. You're a natural. Hmm. Let me answer. I hear the pulse. Let me answer. I hear the pulse. Hey, cool. Please, could you remind me the purpose of my tasks, Professor? Of course, dear. Professor Weasley has kindly asked that I give you some tasks to ensure that your learning continues to flourish outside of the classroom. Once you've completed them all, be sure to return to me, and I'll know that you're ready to learn Flipendo. I just did. Okay, so... Journal. Uh, you know, see my owls. Maybe I, I I got something from her. I forgot about that. Um, where is she? Here she is. Meet me lower Hogsfield as soon as possible. I'd like to talk to you about Rookwood and Harlow. Might be best to do outside of the castle. Natty. Um, lower Hogsfield. All right, so I, I haven't gotten this far with her, I guess. Where is Lower Hogsfield? Hang tight. Let me look it up.
on Lower Hogsfield. I don't know where it is. Um, all right, so we're looking for Lower Hogsfield, guys. Let's use the map. Let's see if I can find it. Um, world map. Back it out. And Lower Hog... Let's, let's see. Hogwarts Valley. Lower Hogsfield. Here we go. Here it is. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, and just try to find Natty, because she she's the one I ha I need to get to, to be able to get my my mount. So we gotta forward her stuff as fast as possible. Not sure how I'd fare in a little place like this. Revelio. First of all, I can unlock that. So let's do Hello, that. Amora. she be? Is that her? No, that's not her. Who are you? If you're here for my wares... On, about your carts. Oh, yes. Still missing, unfortunately. I'm hoping they return to me soon, but I fear my hopes may be in vain. All right, well... Hello, Mr. Semi. What can I do for you? Let um, me see what you got. What do you have for sale? What can I help you? I have some cash on. Well, a little, not very much. I we'll go with the Wigan Welds for ah, now. Yes, a wonderful choice. I don't care about the rest of it. I can make the rest. I hope to see you again sometime. All right. You gotta be around here After somewhere. What Ranrock did to that goblin banker at Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Arn. What about a Mabus? You said Hogsmeade? What about Hogsmeade? Just so you know, guys, if you're going to make a comment um, about the game or gameplay, um, please make full sentences so we understand each other. Because with chat lag being what it is, we um, there's a, lost, a lot that's lost in translation. Um, what about Hogsmeade? This is Hogsmeade. Owl Post. To wait till daytime to meet, maybe. Lower Hogsfield, this is where I'm at. She wants to talk to me about Rick and uh, Harlow. Yeah, Mavis, like I said, there's a chat lag. And if your internet is slow, or you're using your phone, it's even slower.
So instead of uh, you telling me how late I am, why don't you explain what you mean by hogs meat? That'd be more helpful. Do you want to me go show you hogs meat? Because I can, if that's what you're wanting. I don't understand what you mean. A single word doesn't mean anything to me, okay? I got 14 years with a woman. Uh, uh, I've been married to a woman for 14 years who does that kind of shit to me per, uh, uh, you know, every day. And her English, because she's not from this country. And so we constantly go back and forth where I'm telling, like, explain to me what you need in full sentences. Because otherwise, I don't understand you. So please, allow me to understand you. Let's go up here. Hey, Adamant, what's up, man? Once again, we are, I, I thought I had this worked out, and, and this is frustrating the hell out of me right now. Again. Again! But I am loving the game. Don't get me wrong. I love the game. I would really like to be able to fast travel through time. Because some things you can only do during the day, some things you can only do during the night. Enter when you're trying to find lower hugs. What do you mean? That still doesn't make any sense to me. I'm not trying to find lower hogs feel hog feel I found it. That's what I'm talking about. Oh hey, hey, hey. Give it, give it, give it, give it, give it. Hang on, where's my where's my spell? Got it. Cool. Okay, Mavis, now that I understand a little bit more of why you're doing what you're doing. So that makes sense. Please try to be precise, though. It would be most helpful. And I know I come across as an asshole sometimes. But, uh, but I, it, it's like, I, it's, it's the same thing over and over and over again with people that, uh, that have that are trying to explain something they they want to be quick What's this Lumos but we end up wasting time because of it and i hate wasting time and i hate repeating myself so and i hate doing things over my pet peeves a couple of them I'm just running around here until it gets light. Uh, no, it's a fun game. And it, but the puzzles, man, sometimes the puzzles just get to me. A little bit. Now you're supposed to be Ravenclaw. I know. <laughs> oh, I'm not going to stop. We're going we're gonna to play all the way through. For sure. I need to go to the boathouse, I guess. i got nothing better to do. I'm getting sidetracked is what I'm, what's happening right now today, guys. Because I can't find Natty. There's a sir. I don't, you know, I don't want to do this quest, though. Not yet. Hang on. All right. I mean, I wonder if I shouldn't just go to Sebastian and do Feldcroft. Um, I know that'll push the story forward.
But so many th- uh, guides online are 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 are, are t- saying things that are not correct. Um, that is pissing me off, huh? A lot of us Ravenclaws wait for the others to figure out the puzzles first. Well, I just need to find her. I'm looking for I'm looking for my for my let me go to the, the owl post. I'm looking for Natty, and Natty's uh, saying. Uh, you know, go meet me in Lower Hogsfield as soon as possible. I'd like to talk to you about Rick and Harlow, but I think I've already done this. Do we, is there a way of telling if I've already... Are, they, are these the ones I have not done yet? See, I already know DePulso. I think I already did that. I think we've already gotten these posts. I think this is uh, that was a dead end. I think I I think I've already got I've already talked to Natty. So maybe I need to push my my quest forward a little bit. Let's go ahead and do that. Um Let's do the main quest here. Cuz it's right here. Meet Sebastian at Feldcroft. We'll do that. That's fine. Um It's a long way off, too. Should probably fast travel. Where is Felcroft? Down here? Okay. We haven't been here yet, so... I'll get as close as I can. We'll go from there. What are you up to now? Um, about 25 feet in the air. This is what I want. I want a one-wheel drone style uh, broom. That's what I want. Somebody make one. A drone that I, that, that it's got a, it's like a one-wheel, but it looks like a broom. Hop on it and go. I just set it, put it out in the universe, so somebody's going to make one soon. Oh, hello. off Rebellion. Mm, need a fast travel point somewhere over here not you made it enjoying the view keeping an eye on things Feldcroft isn't what it used to be. No one has felt safe here since Ranrock's loyalists took a peculiar interest in that castle over there. Rookwood Castle. My uncle Solomon is a former Aura and refuses to look into it. Even after Anne was cursed by one of them. Possibly with a wand, no less. I heard a goblin refer to wizard kind as wand carriers. 
A goblin's forbidden from carrying wands. Precisely. That's why I'm on the hunt for answers. If I'm to cure her, I need to understand what happened to her. Anne was always the most mischievous of the three of us. Which is saying something, knowing me and Ominous. I'm hoping a surprise visit from me and a new friend from Hogwarts will help lift her spirits. Bring back the Anne I used to know. Come on. I'll take you to my uncle's. This way. Okay. Feldcroft used to be a lot livelier. There it is. With Branrock's lot wandering about all the time, everyone stays out of sight. Here we are. My sister should be just inside. Then go inside. All right, whatever. Aha! Sebastian, where did you? Is that what I think it is? We've been over this, boy. Hey. Shrivel figs cannot reverse a curse. Nothing can. The sooner you accept that reality, the better. What a douche. But we haven't tried everything. There is no cure! When will you accept that? Never. I can never accept it. <laughs> now look what you've done. <laughs> I'm sorry. Me. Okay. I'm sorry you had to see that. Well, you don't point. mind. I just need a moment alone. Poor Sebastian. Not the visit he'd hoped for. Speak with Anne and Solomon, okay. I'm sorry about earlier. Those bouts of pain are difficult to bear. Are you all right, Anne? I, I didn't mean to intrude. You didn't, truly. And I'm all right. The pain from this curse comes in bouts, and often suddenly. It's hey, Anna, not Amy. anyone's fault. It's nice to meet you, by the way. Welcome back to You her. must be the new fifth year Sebastian told me about. I am. Sebastian and I met during a rather lively duel in defense against the dark arts. Oh, dear Professor Hecate. She's a powerful witch. And she knows how to keep students like my brother and me in line. I do miss Hogwarts, but I wouldn't mind being in Feldcroft, really, if it wasn't so dreary now. Between the goblins at the castle and my uncle fighting with Sebastian whenever he's home, it's not the cosy retreat it once was. Sebastian mentioned something about your uncle being an ex-Aura, but refusing to go after Ranrock's loyalists. I must say, I wasn't prepared for him to be as angry as he was. Uncle Solomon is frustrated by what happened to me. And by Sebastian for thinking he can fix it. They both mean well, I know they do, but my uncle is right. This curse cannot be undone. I can feel it. Sebastian cannot take away my pain. Perhaps you can help him to understand that. I'll do my best. I can promise to speak with him about it. Thank you. His search for a cure is futile, I'm afraid. I'm getting tired. I should probably rest. Thank you for stopping by. I wish you well. Revelio. Hogwarts isn't the same without you. Well, sharp as it's it still is foul, but I know what you mean. Hoping you're feeling better, Sebastian. All right, what else we got? Jangle, jangle. This is my potion kit, not yours. Leave, leave my things be. Okay, that's funny. My potion kit! Oh, what's this? An apple? I'm gonna eat an apple. I'm hungry, kid! Gotta go! What's her ailment? She got cursed. She's got, she, she was cursed, so we don't know what, what the curse is yet, but we're gonna work on it. Um... You an eyeball chest? No. Get out of my way, get out of my way. 
Road training uh, fireball scarf. All right, so. No, I don't want to abandon it. No. Um, so I have to speak with Solomon now. It was over here. Okay. That boy will fray my last nerve. Excuse me, Mr. Sallow. Oh, yes. Sebastian's friend. I apologize on behalf of my nephew. He doesn't know when to stop. I was about to check on Anne. Did I see you come from the house? How is she? She's all right. She said she was going to rest. Nothing can be done for her. Mm. It could be that you've not yet discovered the cure. Ah, you sound like Sebastian, thinking you know better than the healers at St. Mungo's. Perhaps the healers don't know everything, sir. Sebastian is single-mindedly focused on finding a way to help his sister. If there is a cure, he will find it. Your faith in Sebastian is misplaced. No. Some sort of dark magic old. cursed Anne. And the goblins aren't likely to explain themselves any time soon. Giving her hope is cruel. The only thing to do now is keep Anne comfortable and stay out of the loyalists' way. What do I think you're going to trap your daughter? Huh? With all due respect, sir, hope could keep Anne's spirits up. You may mean well, but I know what's best for Anne and Sebastian. They are my stubborn brother's children. Oh, your uncle. Especially Sebastian. If you really want to be of help, you'll make sure Sebastian does what he should do, not what he wants to do. He's no idea the harm he could do if he doesn't stop. Yeah, no. I hope you'll remember what I've said. Yeah, no. Good day. I ought to see how Sebastian's faring. Why will he not listen to me? She's my sister. How are you doing, Sebastian? You got a first-hand glance of what I'm dealing with. I apologize for my uncle. No, you shouldn't have to. He's an asshole. I'll admit, I wasn't expecting him to be so angry. He's always angry. He's been angry since my parents died. I get that, though. After Anne was hurt, he only grew worse. It's as though he blames me somehow. Always calling me my father's son. As if that's an insult. I'm the one trying to help her. He's simply given up. Both Anne and your uncle seem genuinely convinced that nothing more can be done for her. I refuse to believe that. Anne's pain is more than physical. It has changed her entirely. I miss my sister. And I'm going to get her back. You're not gonna, Come though. with me. That's a thing. I need thing. to show you where it happened. You're not going to, you're not going to get her back. Loyalists are capable of so Once much damage more is done, it's realize. done. They should not be underestimated. Well, let's fight some goblins then. Let's go. All the debris you'll see is from whatever's going on at that abandoned estate. They've been digging for something. Buggers? Troll buggies. Up there, on that plateau, is where they cursed Anne. This way. How much longer are we expected to dig through this rubble? Ramrock knows what he's doing. It's an honor to be a part of it. Oh, yeah, here we go. You ready? Rebellion. I got you, man. I got you. That was. Gotta go! Just you wait till I'm on solid ground! Uh, uh, no! 
Yeah, buddy. Oh, shit. You're a little douchebag, yes you are. Oh, shit. What are you doing? What is this? You've made your last mistake. Nope. Not yet. I'm gonna make many more mistakes. Okay, hang on. Nice. Lot of loot. Lot of loot. Hmm. I confess. That was a bit more than I bargained for. It was awesome, though, wasn't it? I tried it? to warn you. So, hey guys, so the the uh, the Glacius uh, charm. When you you have to run up to him and you and and use the uh, uh, the uh, Totalis finisher, you have to run up to them to finish them. And the thing is, is they. Um, it can only happen if there's nobody else targeting you. So it has to be on against a, a single opponent, so. Those loyalists deserved what they got. Couldn't agree more. This is where it happened. We smelled smoke in the middle of the night. When we looked outside, flames were shooting from the estate. Before my uncle and I could stop her, Anne rushed out, racing towards the fire, worried someone would be hurt. She came face to face with a horde of goblins, frantically trying to stamp out the flames. Suddenly, an icy voice drifted out from somewhere in the smoke. Children should be seen and not heard. A blinding blast followed. They didn't even give her a chance to run. Hmm. It seems an awfully violent response to a child wandering by. What were they trying to hide? My thoughts exactly. It may be grasping at Billywigs, but I keep thinking that there's something Billy here Wicks. that could lead me to whoever cursed Anne. Might be the only way to learn what type of magic harmed her, which could help me find a cure. Perhaps you're right. The loyalists are everywhere, but they do seem to be spending a lot of time here, and it's likely they're hiding something. And at Rookwood Castle. Shall we have a look around? They seem to have set up camp here for a specific reason. They have stations for everything. Okay. Sure. Revelio. <laughs> Always armed and ready for a fight, Ranrock's loyalists. What's this? 
Whose home was this? Home? Abandoned long since I've lived here. Oh. Rumor was. Centuries ago. But that's all I ever heard. Oh, this is cool. I've heard goblin dig sites like these are popping up everywhere. Hmm. It's a wonder the Ministry isn't doing more. It might be worth taking a closer look at the house itself. I just did. You mean this tent? Rebellion. Well, that house. Well, hang on. We're gonna sell some uniforms here in a minute. This well, though. This well looks familiar. Sebastian, I've seen this before. This house, the well, the view. What do you mean? When? Give me a moment. I'll explain in a second. Okay, the game said, give me a moment. But Rebellion. It's a mirror. Yep. Sebastian. Over here, do you think that this was damaged by the fire the night that Anne was cursed? Could be. But it looks to me as though this was intentional. Sebastian, this house did belong to a Hogwarts professor hundreds of years ago. Who? What do you- I found a pensive that day in the restricted section with a memory that showed this house. There was a little girl and a drought. The keepers have shown me other memories as well. The girl became a Hogwarts professor. Her name was Isadora Morganark. She was one of the keepers. The keepers? Mo Morgana. Like in Quidditch. And you found a pensive in the library. I'm not following you. I realize it's a lot to take in. I'm not even sure I understand it all yet. And no, not like Quidditch. They call themselves keepers because they're protecting some type of knowledge. It has to do with the vault at Gringotts. Let me see if I've got this straight. You have Ranrock and Rookwood after you because of something you found at Gringotts where you ended up via a port key. And now you've been witnessing memories left by keepers. You oh, sound balmy. And this house belonged to a Hogwarts professor who was one of these non-Quidditch keepers hundreds of years ago. Yep. If I didn't know you, I'd think you were pulling my leg. It is all a bit much, isn't it, when you put it like that? The point is, we both have good reason to search this house. You for answers about what happened to Anne, and me for answers about the keepers. Look at this. What I miss? Someone I... piled this here for a reason. Is it blocking something? That's Only fine. one way to find out. Probably. Huh, a stairwell. Oh, hello. Ah! My, I, my, my character styling looks pretty sharp. I know, right? When I got up close, I didn't realize I was wearing a, um, see the, uh, the, the neck piece? I forget what my grandfather used to call it. My grandfather used to wear those all the time instead of a tie. Um, what are they called? Does anybody remember? It's around my neck right there. Not the scarf, but the, uh, but the, uh, it's, it's two pieces of string that goes around your neck and you, and you slide the, the piece up to, to tighten your collar. But I can't remember what they're, what they're called. Uh, but yeah, my grandfather used to wear those all the time. Why bother blocking a stairwell? There might be something here. They've left all of this simply strewn about. It tells me they're after something bigger. Spiders. I traveled here to learn, but I long to help. My eternal struggle is overwhelming. It's as though my magic... The magic wants to heal, and I'm the one preventing it to, from doing so. Should I lose hope? Will I ever forget, forever regret not having done more? I cannot look into their eyes knowing that I could lessen the burden of heartache. 
I saw the man leaving camp today. The only one, who, the one who reminded, so reminded me of my father. Surely it wouldn't hurt to help him. I could further my research, of course, but that would be fortuitous consequence of something good, good with this ability. Um, is he like not wanting to use his powers? Seems these journal entries are from Isadora's travels. Spiders under the floor, man. This is, oh, it's one of seven, by the way. Okay, it is my second week in camp. More arrived each day. The muggle doctors and even some of our healer, own healers are doing all they can for them. The grief is palpable. The ones who have survived the plague are forever damaged by their loss. Fever may pass and the skin may mend and, and scar, but David's getting sorrow remains. I saw a man much like my father who had lost a child. I couldn't bear it. I longed to give him some shred of relief. I'm beginning to think that the others are wrong. I have the power to help these souls. It seems arbitrary not to help them as it would be r r to rid them of their torment. A journal entry of his adorers. I should hold on to this. Hang on a second. This sh shit right here. Get away from me. Rebellion. Hmm. Tight. Can bring them. There we go. You're not going to believe this. I can see the undercroft. What? A daydream. Because that happens to me, too. The bolo. Yeah, it's a bolo. Lumos. Couldn't bring up. Expelliarmus. Glacius. Lumos. I know it sounds strange, but honestly, I... nothing you say sounds strange to me anymore. Fair enough. I can see the undercroft through this stone wall as though it's a window. This has happened before. I'm listening. I have a rare ability to see whispers of ancient magic. I don't know what I was expecting you to say, but it wasn't that. <laughs> I knew you weren't telling me everything. Ancient magic. What does that even mean? I'm not entirely sure, but the Keepers have said that it's a powerful magic that should only be wielded by a select few. And you can wield it? I don't know, but Fig and I think that Ranrock has somehow found a way to harness that magic's power. Are you telling me that goblins may be wielding some sort of wizard magic? That's what we're trying to find out. What I do know is that my ability allows me to travel through these windows I see. Wait. We can get straight to the Undercroft from here. Ominous will be flawed. We can. But perhaps best not to tell anyone else about this for now. Even Ominous. Understood. Well then, invisible secret ancient magic passageway. Here we come. Okay, Nick, to answer I'm your question. To hold my breath. Hang tight. Alright, so to answer your question, to Nick, about 32 hours, 33 hours. I also have another six hours on another character. Because I've been uh, uh, getting stuff ready for recording uh, how-to videos. Um, but a lot of the stuff that people are, are putting out there are not is not correct. So I'm trying to correct it. Um, that's why I get so frustrated when we can't figure something out. Because once we do figure it out, oh, I'll, I'll slap it on, on, on YouTube. But, yeah, see, I thought I could just do it but whenever I wanted to. Here we go. Undercroft. So I'm basically playing the game again on the backside of playing this game. Is what I'm doing. Because you only have so many save slots. Oh, I love the green glasses. Dude, those are cool. Why would the door lead us here? Sebastian, look.
Why hide a triptych here? Seems as if something's missing. A note. Let's have a look. Okay. Can I rotate this? No, I can't. So, what do we see in here? We got the symbols here, boom and boom. And this is up and down and there's four there's two spikes this way and then two little spikes that way. Another symbol here. I'm sure it's going to reveal itself. Anything helpful in the notes? A rune symbol. I've seen similar symbols used by the keepers. I've been thinking. A keeper lived in that house centuries ago, and Ranrock and his lot have been searching there. You said that goblins may be wielding some form of this ancient magic. Do you think Anne was cursed by ancient magic? I can't be sure, of course, but I don't think so. I didn't see any traces of it around your sister. Hmm. Very well. But that doesn't mean it's not ancient magic. There's still so much we don't know about it. True. Perhaps this triptych will lead us to answers. Then we'll have to unravel what this all means. But now I need to see Ominous. Don't worry, I won't tell him anything. Did I mention that, apparently, Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here, in Hogwarts? You did not. Sounds worth looking into. Any idea where in the castle? No idea. Ominous just learned of it. I'll let you know what I find out. I had no idea our visit to Sian would unfold into all of this. My head's an utter mess. But I'm glad you told me everything you did. I'll be in touch. Till then. So he's asking, uh, what's the back of the jacket looks like a dragon's back. What's the name of your jacket? It's a dragon skin coat, dude. It's a dragon skin coat. <laughs> and I have, um, and I have uh, leprechaun gloves. <laughs> I don't know if they're made out of the skin of a leprechaun, but, you know. Um, so, yeah, right now, I have an F. These are called... Uh, lucky Leprechaun Gloves. And then the coat. Oops. Is the Dragonhide Protector's Cloak. Uh, fashioned from Dragonhide for the, the bravest defenders earned by defeating Ashwinders and Poachers. Um, which I got, and I like the look of it. And I, I, I'm, I, I am looking stylish, dude. See my gloves? If I hit you in the face with my glove, it's going to make a mark. <laughs> and these boots need to be better. They need to have points. I mean, I don't mean like the elf points. I mean like knives. But, you know, I'm liking what I... And I've got, looks like, van braces on my forearms. The scarf happened to match. Um... I could use a better vest, though, but that bolo tie is not, not bad. Yeah, it's tight, right? It's good, yeah? I like it. Especially with his hair, you know? If I could grow hair like that anymore, I would. And those are the, I, those are the, the glasses, the sunglasses I wear, pretty much, when I go out. Meet me near the ruins. Revelio. Oh, hey, there we go. Natsai Onai, meet me near the ruins in the Felbarton uh, Castle. God dang it, man. That's exactly what I had to do. I had to forward the story. Ah, see? That's not it. This one. Meet me near the ruins of Falbarton Castle after dark. Do not tell anybody. Natty. There we go. All right, we're gonna get our we're gonna get our mount, guys. We gotta go. Sorry, buddy. I know you had a problem and all, but I gotta go. Cause that's what this this live stream is all about. Can we get a somebody to type in when I get done with this? Can we get a marker on what on what time it was that I, I, I got the note? Because that I, I wasn't far enough in the main story to be able to get my mount. So now we can. If I can get out of here. Defense against a dark arts tower. What? The John Wick of Hardworks. I said that yesterday, Tui. Like, who am I, John Wick? That's what that clock was. Okay, we're in the basement, like for the uh, for uh, for all the uh, here. This is where you go for all the your all of your curses. Um, 
Which would be under collect talents? Talents, right? Yeah. Your dark art stuff is all learned down there. So, um, but I haven't learned anything. I, I, I actually took a, I thought I took a perk with that, but maybe not. Or talent. Now, I have two. Okay, we're at tw level 21, guys. I want one more level. One more level, and I can start unlocking the, the highest level spells I can get, which is really cool. Started stream 106 minutes ago. Let me, hang on. Let me put that in a, in a notepad. Um, 106. All right. So that's when I realized. Hang on. I got to save this as Hogwarts notes. Save. You guys get a little peek behind the curtain. All right, so, so one more level, and actually, look at this. We're almost at level twenty-two. Look how, look how, um, how full that bar is, that experience bar. We only need a little bit more, and I can unlock all the spells that I would want. So this one is, well, I mean, that's assuming that. Oh shit. Transformation Mastery, enemies struck with the transformation spell transform into explosive objects. So not only if you hit them with something, <laughs> they turn into explosive objects? Oh, oh, they say enemies, but I think what they mean is if I pick up a box with the transformation spell, it'll turn into a bomb, which is really powerful. Because there's a lot of throwables around here. That's great. That's good. All right. That's cool, man. I like that. Because I already have the Glacius Mastery where I can stri strike the enemy frozen and, and damaging shards outward from the target. Um, so I can get this, I think. I think so. All right. So let's go and let's look at our core. When I hit level 22, there are two things that we can do. Stupefy deals direct damage on impact. Which it would be nice if I ever used Stupefy. But you got to use your shield. I never block. I, I never block. I just don't. Uh, I should do more. I should block more, though. Uh, per, uh, okay. A perfect per, uh, Protego releases a damaging blast that breaks enemy shields. That's kind of cool. But what's a perfect Protego? Anyway, um, let's see. What else do we have in here? I don't think there's anything. I'm looking at 22s right now, okay, because we're getting close. If I were to have the Dark Arts, I would have access to Avada Kedavra, which I, I'm, I'm not because I, I don't have enough points. And I haven't done any Dark Arts in this game. So, uh, wait, so played all morning. Wow, what a game. Uh, the game is fans all over. Uh, if, if waiting for. No, I like this game. This is actually, if I were in a Harry Potter movie, this would be what uh, this would be. I mean, this puts you in a Harry Potter movie. It does. Pretty much. Because you're learning about, you know, being being a wizard. It gives you everything that, that I, I could ask for. I mean, there are maybe a couple things. But I'm not, I, I never read the books. I only, only watch the movies. So, so yeah, not bad, Flappajacks, right? Flappajacka, right? I'm going to start calling you Flapjacks because I, I can't pronounce your name, evidently. So, let's go ahead and go Stealth. And that top one is going to be Perfectus uh, Totalis em emanates an area of effect that can impact uh, nearby enemies. So here's the thing. Um, oh, I see what that is. That's an essential spell, right? I think it is. Maybe it's not. But you can petrify multiple enemies in an AoE. That's really good. Because then you could finish them. All right. So, and then room of re re requirement is going to give me three things. I don't have, do I have all these? I don't think I do. It's going to be uh, the range and damage of the potion effect is greatly increased. So when I, okay, that's cool. The focus potion will be extended and the... A venomous uh, uh, tentacula deals additional damage and breaks shields. Oh, I need that. I, flat, I, sh I slap down a plant and, and it breaks the shields of my enemies? 
and it does it more damage. I don't care about the damage. Breaking the shields of my enemies are great. That's a that, okay. That's probably going to be my my go to right there. That's going to be great. That's amazing. Uh, th these are those are my things for so far to be cool. Have uh, more common room activities, etc. Um, you're talking about your your uh, your secret room, Flappa, because um, you can expand it, but I think only with more um, more beast areas, and they're different biomes, is what I've read. So I think they're just different biomes. All right. Anyway, so good stuff coming up here really quick. Um, I, I don't know what I'm going to take, but we're going to find out. What do you guys think in the comments? Let me know what I should be taking for my 22-level spell. My, my, my 22nd first-level spell. Oh, it's a Goblin Rebellion. Because evidently, we treated them like crap. What I'd like to see in the next step, in the next version of this game is the House Elves rising up. Because that's what they should have done. The house elves coming up, but I guess you gotta have to have something that looks like a bad uh, like a bad guy. But then you could you could like lighten it up a little bit. I don't mean whitewash it. God damn man, people are gonna rail me on the internet. I mean like you have different characters that are being oppressed and it, and they deserve to rise up. So goblins being one, um, the uh, the uh, the house goblins being a, one I would love to see because they have powerful magic. Right, I mean they can they can pop out in and out. They don't need a wand. Anyway, I'm getting I'm getting beside myself here. I'm, so anyway, let's go quests. Uh, meet Natty after dark. <laughs> meet Natty after dark. The high keep. Okay, here we go. So yeah, this is what you got to do. This is what this guy didn't tell you, or tell me. You got to meet with Deke, then Sebastian, and and then you have to meet Natty after dark, then attend astronomy class. Okay, those you got to. I guess you have to do these in order. These are the main quests. So you can do two, three, four, five, five of them really quickly. I because Law Duck is not a problem. Beast class is not a problem. Uh, none of these are an issue. They're really pretty fast stuff. You should be able to get your mount before you get your broom, I think. If you play it right. Maybe not. Maybe not. You may get your broom before you get your mount. But your mount should be easy. Let's go get him. Speaking of which. Alright. No, no, I said map, dude. Alright, we gotta go back to Hogwarts. So let's go let's go to secret rooms right quick. Room of requirement. And then we'll, I'll drop out of there after that. All right, so, real quick, let's gather our plants. No, no, no. My potion station is too close to my other my other station. Whoops. And drinks. Yeah, I don't think I have. I don't think I need uh, any more shrivel figs. What I want to do is we're going to empty this pot and we're going to put in the, uh, the, uh, the uh, tenacula because I only get one per. So I need I need to do more than that. So there's flex, flux weed stem can go away too. We can go ahead and empty that pot and I can go ahead and do this again. Uh, what, this is going to be my, my, my venomous corner. I mean, even though we have the, the mandrakes over here. Um, I have 22 potions still. I'm not going to worry about getting po making potions until I'm mean, like, what do I have here? I've got three um, Edoras potions. I've got a single Maxima. I don't have any focus potions, but that's okay. It just reduces the uh, the, the spell coon. You know what? Maybe I will make a focus potion. I think I should be able to make a couple. I've got, oh, I've got a bunch. I can make six. Hang tight right quick. Let's do those. Uh, I got three for Thunder Brews. One invisibility, because, I, I mean, I, I can already go invisible. It's not a big deal. Um, uh, Mandrake, Chinese Chopping Cabbage, and uh, Ve Venomous. We're going to go ahead. I'm going to uh, show you guys how to use these in the future. I might get it get to it today, 
But we're gonna we'll definitely get to it. I need a Chinese chomping cabbage though, is what I need. So hang on a second. Let me let me let me go ahead and grow that. I think I have the po I already have the seeds. I just didn't grow any. Um, let's see here. I need herbology. I think they require the big ones. And you, there's a there's a bar here as well as what you see here, by the way. So I've got the, the large potting tables, medium, smalls, composters, which I don't have a composter, but I, I need one. Uh, and chopping stations, which will occasionally make a plant byproduct. I, I would like to get that. That'd be cool. Maybe I'll get something cool. But let's do it and let's drop this potting table. You can only do it where you have room, okay? So I don't have a ton of room left, but I think I'm going to go... I might fit it right here. Oh, man. You know what? I just need to get in between them and up those stairs as soon as I get my new biome. Um, so I just need to get in between these guys. Let's go. I could put it right here, maybe, huh? Gonna back it out. Back it out. There we go. That's fine. That's okay. I think that's good. And do I want to do another one? Probably. God, I'm getting crowded in here, yo. We could probably move those closer together, but we're not gonna. All right. I'm gonna do a couple of Chinese uh, chopping cabbage. Large pots, boom. Okay, I could do medium too if I wanted. We're, we'll move these around and change them up later, but right now I'm just gonna go ahead and go like this. There we go. Cool. I love being able to have my garden indoors. I, this is my dream, right? It's also my nightmare this winter in real life because I realized that they're, they're, if there are bugs, they don't go anywhere. So I've got aphids and I've got uh, freaking um, uh, fruit flies and that and they're, they're in my house right now. I mean, well, the aphids don't really bother my, me, just the plants. But um, yeah, the fruit flies are a whole different trip. I've got a whole thing in my house now. You guys are going to get an earful of that uh, when it comes to my uh, my homestead channel coming up in April. All right, let's go with... Um, I wanted to make the... Well, I can make seven? Hang on. Sorry. But we're going to make we're gonna make these, uh, these potions right quick. I didn't know I could make more. I don't really need them, but... I'm using A and D to rotate around my table. And then F to pick up. Let's try something a little bit more challenging. Rocky skin. Uh... Oh yeah, the focus potion. I can do six. They take a minute each, so let's do that. And then, pick that up, click on that. Alright, so, I'm making three focus potions right now. That's all I'm going to make right now. That's fine, that's, that's good enough. They'll, they'll be ready in a few minutes. Um, Alright, let's go gather some ingredients right quick. If we can. While we're waiting for that to get done. Uh, I can collect this guy. He's way over here. I could have collected it from my inventory, but I want to show you something. So there's this cave right here that is given to you with your, your vivarium. And things are randomly, they randomly generate in here. Okay? Now I've already, not, not maybe not now. Rebellion. That chest has already been opened. You also get yourself some wiggle, uh, some juice. Um, hork lump juice. But the, uh, the the wild plants and and, uh, and and stuff, this all randomly generates um, in different spots. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get rid of it all, collect it all, and you'll see when I come back that it will re it, it'll re uh, re regenerate a little bit. Uh, there, there's not a lot in here, but there is. But it's enough that it makes it worth my while going and collecting everything, right? So. These eggs, I think, are they might be permanent. I'm not sure. So your vivarium is very important. 
Look, didn't I kill all this just now? Hang on. Maybe I didn't. I already opened that chest. Revelio. Okay, so you go over here. Here we go. Now this was all. It, it, this was not here before. This is all random. It changes over time. Over I think three days. Every three days, your uh, your vivarium will re uh, regenerate, and and give you more stuff. So go and collect it all. Cause you're gonna want to do that. Get leeches. That doesn't really matter much. I have plenty of leech juice. Leeches are cheap, dude. All right, so. And hit H2, so I can... This is nurtured already. These all need care? Oh, God. Dang it, man. Hang on. I'm gonna... I gotta... I gotta... I gotta give everybody a brush. Hang on. What the hell? There it is. Now I can trade those out for the uh, the ones in my pocket, but I'm not going to do that right now. I just I just wanted to get these guys. Now see, I, now I can start collecting all of their all of their their animal byproducts because I have their I, I already have them fed, and now I just brushed them. Is all it is. If they ask for nurturing, then you, you just got to hit them with a brush once you have your feeding station. And it's an automatic feed. If you leave for too long, I've seen these lids close. I'm afraid if the last lid closes, and I've got too many animals in here, and I don't go check on it. That they'll all die from starvation. That's my. That's what I'm afraid of. I don't know if it's true, but we're gonna. We'll find out later. All right. So, are we good? Can I collect you? Yeah, buddy. Thank you. All right, we're out of here. I love this room. This room is so good. I don't think I can upgrade any of my stuff, but let's. Uh, you know what? Hang on. I got to make sure I'm not. I'm wearing the best stuff as it is. Now that we're back here, may as well. Let's go inventory. No, 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 no. Hang on. Gear. Here we go. Um, so it looks like I've got a, I've got a, a neckwear that might be better. I got new stuff. No, that's not better. Um, and also, you got to remember, some items have qualities that you might want to keep. That um, they're just natural qualities, like um. Where is it? And you won't have to upgrade them if you like what they do. All right, I, I, but you can change it out. Like, I've got increased damage with Incendio like three times. Scorching three. I've got, I was scorching one. So I've got, yeah, I've got three Incendio amplifications on my armor. And then I've got, um, I've got four. Because I've got one on my neck, face, my glasses, my, uh, my, uh, my hat. Which you can't see because I made it go away. And, um. And my uniform. Now, I could try to... If I try to increase anything, I gotta put the, the, the new stuff on there. And you know what should happen? Is they should up the price that you sell it at when you, um, when you make an upgrade. Because it should be worth more. Because you can say, this will give more damage when I cast this spell. And, and the pawn shop should take it and go, oh yeah, well that's much better. And they should, you should be able to get more money. But they don't. So if you don't, I mean, it's it, except for like the um, the journal uh, quests, you get credit for for upgrading stuff, but don't waste your time on a bunch of stuff that's going to be like expensive for you to do, because then you're just wasting materials. In my opinion, you know, what do I know? I've been playing for about forty hours, and um, and I've been jer I mean, but I've been jerking around too. I've been j jumping over here, there, the other thing. Didn't really know where to go. It was kind of slow. But now I know, I kind of know what's going on. So, um, and I don't play a lot of these games either, right? Mine's pretty linear, with an open world. This guy, they got the side quests and everything like that, which I don't normally do. But now I'm changing my game a little bit. Should I talk to the professor? Yes, I should talk to the professor. I'm babbling now. You guys are getting bored. Anyway, let's go ahead. Oh, you know what? Let's go gear right quick to so make sure there's nothing that's really. No, it's all down. All right. 
Um, I kind of want to upgrade the, the golden snitch scarf. I might have what it takes. Okay. Let me buzz through this right quick. Uh, I need to figure... I need to unlock that one. I'm, I'm here at the house. Let's do that. Hang on. I got some stuff I have to identify. You have an identification table when you get this room. It's right here. Oh, yeah, totally. I have no un unidentified... G oh, it's locked because I'm too low level. That's what it is. That's fine. No worries. In that case... We will... Uh, not wear those. Or that. Or those. Huh. I thought there was something better. Wasn't there just something better just a second ago? What was it? Face wear? Oh, it was face wear. 41. All right, so there's no trade applied on this one. It's going to drop my offense, uh, offense by 12. That's only because I've got uh, Scorching 1 on these. But is it a higher level? It is a higher level. So it might give me better traits. Let's wear those. Hang on. And now we're going to upgrade my eyewear. So. Are these them? Uh, let's give them a trait. Let's give them... Will it let me do a Scorching 3? Nope. It's too powerful for this item. Ancient magic focus. Nope, won't let me. Scorching one's the best I can do. Which is, or I could do ancient magic. But my ancient magic is strong enough that I haven't had a problem. We'll start upgrading that later. Um, so the scorching is good. Okay. And then that's a trait that I have on the other one too. So. Now we're going to view our upgrade on this one. And we'll upgrade our gear with the feathers. I can do that again. And now, I, and I have the deer, uh, deer uh, call feathers now. So we can upgrade that again. So that just upped my... my up, okay, so it upped me by 12. It's the same. It didn't do any more. You can change your traits out, though. I did, I did figure that out. So, um, all right. And hang on. Are these the glasses I want? I guess so. They're the same glasses. Okay, so we got to meet Natty. You said talk to the professor, but what do you mean? What professor are we talking about? Uh, Kagawa, Sharp, or Onai? Because I can get Descendo from Onai, I can get Defendo from Sharp, and I can get uh, uh, Kagawa from, uh, I can get Arresto Momentum. Arrest of Momentum is a really powerful spell. Um, so I can do all three of these and get three more spells. I was going to wait till tomorrow to do it, but we can do it. It's fine. Um, well, let's do the high keep, though. Oh, the one in my room of requirement? No, I don't need two, James. There's, uh, I've got nothing. I've got nothing. Uh, she's got nothing for me. It's always the same question. Uh, it, it might change in a minute. Wait. Hang on. It might change. Hang on. We'll check. She might have something else. We'll check it. I have some questions about alteration. See, it's all about alteration, Professor. Yes? It's all the same things. Now, if you want to watch me ask that question a dozen times, you can go back to a previous stream. I'm not going to bother with it. Thank you, Professor. I have no more it, it's basically just how to use the, how to anything. conjure the uh, the tables and move things around and change the way they look and things like that. Because you can change the color on stuff. Like this, I, I laid this carpet down. I laid all these carpets down. 
Like right, this one's purple. This one's green. I, okay, let me just show you real quick. It's easier if I just show you. Um, so I need to go to the altering spell, and we'll go. I guess I'll do that. Let's flip that though. I'm gonna do that. All right, so. I want to alter something and just hit two. And now I can change the color by using F. I can move it around. I can change the color by using F. I can go... Oop, hang on. Uh, e, I want purple. And then hit left mouse. And now that purple one is like that purple one. See? Potato! Oop, potato! Potato! Are we ready? Not yet. Okay, we're leaving. It's actually still daytime, though, so we could actually go do something else. Um, what's this? We have a broom racing event? No. But uh, we can go to Hogsmeade right quick. I have to be, it has to be after, after dark before I can talk to her, so... I've got some stuff to sell, so let's go ahead and let's go to... The Wizardware place. We'll use that as my fast travel. Perhaps you didn't alter something the game wants you to do. The room gets bigger after you do. What do you mean? Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Oh, all right. You know what, James? Hang on a second. I'm gonna sell my stuff, and you can we can talk about this. Hang on. Maybe. Oh, it's dark now too. Hang on. I just have to get to her before dawn, so we've got a little bit of time. The fuck? That's not what I want. I mean, I do want that quest, I just didn't want it right now. I gotta sell my stuff, get see how much money I can get. Hey, big boy. Hey Please uh, come in. Let me know if you need help finding anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so I'm gonna sell everything. I'm just gonna double check. There's nothing I want to keep. Well, I mean those, but I have to be level 22. To, so well, that's shitty. So I'm gonna keep these glasses, but I want to get rid of those uh, that coat. I think. Everything else. Yeah, okay, so sell it all. This is the best money in the game, really. Now, is there, what, is there anything? Oh, wow. 63. It'd be nice if I knew how, how much I was going up. Is it worth it? Six, in the 60s, probably. Hang on, let me look at my armor right quick. I suspect you have a sharp eye for fashion. Be sure to stop. No, I do have a sharp eye for fashion. 20, no, 42, 41, 57. So my hat's good. 40, 44, 56. So my, my outfit and my headwear are close. So I need to do neckwear, robes, handwear, and facewear and go upgrade my stuff. Guys, bear with me because I want to make sure I'm as good as possible right now. You know what? It didn't really matter. I'm fine. We're coming back, though. We're coming back. Hey, Wade, what's up? But yeah. Um, okay, let's get out of town very quick. World map. Go here. Go there. Let me eat Natty. And we'll, we'll get this done. I want my mount. This is what this whole thing's been about. We've been going for two hours and 20 minutes, by the way. And OBS is not frozen on me. Have you guys noticed? Have Yesterday, it was a rough deal. Your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. 
All right. There we go. Psst, over here, quietly. I am glad that you received my owl. We need to stay low and remain quiet. Fazzy, what's going on? Why are we all the way out here? As promised, I did some investigating to find out what Harlow is up to. I followed him to the Hulk's head. I noticed him reading a letter. All I could see was that it was signed by and bore the seal of Victor Rookwood. And after you told me that Rookwood and Harlow were after you, I decided that you were the perfect person to join me in taking them down. For good. That letter is the tangible proof that Officer Singer needs. It is why I followed Harlow here and why I wrote to you. I need your help to retrieve it. You seem to be very determined in stopping Rookwood and Harlow. Why? I knew men like him in Uganda. I know how bad things can get if they are not stopped. It's their long story, one I promise to share when we have more time. For now, let's do what we came to do. Can't we just bypass Officer Singer and go directly to the Ministry? Do you think they will listen to a student? Only Officer Singer can start an investigation. The Ministry will come in later. Hey Wade, is there an update on Zeus? And thank you for enjoying my streams. I appreciate it. Um, yes, uh, Zeus is, his eyes, go, they come and they go. Sometimes He can blink in his right eye now. I'm hoping for a left eye soon. That should be able to get him some tears so he can go ahead and, otherwise I got to use this ointment for his eyeballs. If you guys don't know, my dog Zeus got poisoned. I think he got poisoned. And he, um, and he almost died. So, um, so he, uh, he's doing better. Um, his, he can close his mouth kind of. His left uh, jowl still droops a little bit, but um, but the the the, uh, the drugs are doing good for him. So I, anyway, that's your update on Zeus. I'll help you find the letter, Natty. I'm glad to hear it. First, we must access the castle keep. I'll check the main gate, see if you can find another way in. I do not see any guards, but we should still try to be as quiet as possible. Hollow is here after all. Okay. So I need to use this charm right here. Revenio. Do do do. Travel broadens the mind. To climb the battlements, it says. Okay, cool. Now my question is, if I'm, oh, hang on, I want these. I was ash these ashwander eggs. So I should be able to climb up this, right? Oh wait, this is what. Hang on. You need. I'm gonna have to use. Levioso. Not let. Yeah. Well. Yeah, Levioso. You lost a dog to a poisoned mouse? Yeah. Oh, well, I think it was a poisoned mouse trap that got it. That I had here in the office. And I let him in the office and he, and he started looking at it when I was streaming and I wasn't paying attention. That's what I think happened. Honestly. I suspect that might have been what it was. Because I found it and it was and, and it had been in where his nose was. And it smells like peanut butter and he eats peanut butter. He loves peanut butter. So I think I poisoned my own dog by mistake. Oh, nothing. Uh, anyway, so let's go ahead and play this game, yeah? Oh, where I, there it is. There it is. Hold tight. So here. There. There. Oh, come on. Oh, I see. Oh, there it is. I almost had it. There it is. What's this? Hmm. I wonder what that does. That is a trap. Maybe not. I don't know. I don't know what it does. But I bet you, if I use this... Nope. Maybe not. Well, that didn't work. Perhaps something with a bit of There it is. That did it. Oh, 
Oh, hang on a second. Oh, uh, so I gotta. Hang on, I know what I gotta do. Yeah. Do this and just pull it out. Now, where do I put it? Over here? Yeah, over here. This has gotta be it, right? I need another one on top of it, I think. Oh, hey, what's up? Cool. Hmm. How do I get that to work? Wait, hang on a second. That's what it is. Okay, um... Okay. Do I have to do it this way? Can I do it while I'm here? I can't do it while I'm standing on it. Um. Hmm. Hmm. How do we do this, guys? Any idea? Anybody got any ideas? I'm listening to your ideas. This is more over here. Hang on. Nope. Revenue. Other levitate? I mean, we can try it. I don't think so, but maybe. Uh. I need to be able to hold it in place. As I move, when I jump, it doesn't. It doesn't want to let me do it. Um. I don't know, man. I'm thinking I need another box, right? It's right here is where I need to be, but I don't know. If I can put it on end, I could do it. Let's see if we can do this. I need to rotate it. Can I rotate it? I need to have it on its end. Because flat like this, it's not, it's not working right. Hang on. Maybe it is the other one. Oh, I see what you're saying. Hang on, I got it. Yeah, no, I see what you're saying, uh, James. Hang on. So it's, it's this levitate, and you got to jump up on there and get up there before it falls. That's what it is. I see it. I see you. Yeah, get up there. There it is. Okay, I understand. Yeah, weird. But okay. Yeah, I, get, I, I need to find a way into the gatehouse to open the gate for Natty. Number one. Look at that. I hear something up top, but I don't see anything. That are probably firebombs, like in Skyrim. Now I want loot, so we're going to look for loot. Dead end. Must Not be another way in. Elf made ivory gloves. That's cool, man. They're the same as what I've got, though. Yeah, I didn't realize that the other Leviosa um, actually held things in place like that. That's cool.
can't do it. Why not? Won't let me cast a spell. Any spell. So, sneak out here. That's weird. It's not working. Revenue. Oh, no way. Well, no, that wouldn't work either. So I should be able to get through here, but it's not letting me. I see. Maybe, well, maybe not. Can you stand up inside the room and you can't cast while you're crouching? Uh, let's see, Roy. I don't know. Maybe. Doesn't look like it, but we can try. Uh, that means I got to... No, I can't. I'm going to have to go... Hang on. I have to get rid of my... My... Charm, and then try to go inside. But it's not letting me up, no. Wait, I'm pushing it. Hang on. I can push it? Hang on. Um. Hang on. So I'm put. Okay, what I'm doing is I'm, I'm, I'm using my W key to, to push against this box. And I'm moving it to the side. That's the only thing I can figure out how to do. So that's what we're doing right now. Until this box moves far enough for me to get behind it. And then, I'm, there we go. Not yet. I mean, this is probably not how it was intended. But I'm going to use this anyway as, as a way to get behind the box. Not yet. Alright, hang tight. We can move it this way. It's really weird, dude. I'm pushing it. There we go. Definitely not as intended, that looks but as if it might raise the gate. Get this thing out of my way, yo. I'm gonna need that later, probably, for right there. So let's go ahead and let's. Move this back over here. And then I'm, hang on, what to say? I can't believe I had to write this down, but uh, you moon minds don't listen. Push the gate open, don't blast it. If I find it plumb the pieces again, I'll swear I'll end you lot. Okay, so what are we doing this? you get inside? I don't know. How do I lock it? Once I once I get it to where I want it to be. Oh, that's how they mean it to happen. Okay. So, see, you know what? Did you just find that out, dude? Let's go down this. Oh, 
I gotta talk to her and then I gotta I gotta hit this uh, spell. It is quite frightening that we do not study apparition until our sixth year. We could get past this gate instantly. Rebellion. No trolls. That means there's probably trolls. Um. This town is stronger than I have thought. They do not want anyone getting in. Well, I kind of want you to get in, but I, I don't know how I'm going to do that. This Rebellion. Yeah, I think you're right, to be honest. Let me listen. Box widget, what do you mean? Unless they want me to put that box down or bring the box down and hold it open. I don't know how you how you do that though. Um There it was. You just guessed? Hang on. Okay, I see. I, I know how it is. Hang on. Ah! Did I do it? I don't, don't think I did. I don't think I did it. She's got to run back here and get her own way in, dude. What I'm trying to do. She's not she's not through. She's still on the other side. I'm trying to do that, Tui. Not easy. But I can see what the deal is though. That's why you need the other one. Alright, so... I should be able to just push it... Push it in there, maybe. They can push it. Maybe that's how I'll do it. Seems... It's just gonna... It's gonna be a lot easier for me to do it that way, I think. Um... No! You bastard. Oh, I see. Hang on, I got this. I, I, I got it. I got it. I got it. I think. Let me move it. Be stuck right here on something here. Try that. Is 
Definitely stuck on something, that chain. Maybe I have to do it this way. Oh, I know what it is. I think. Hang tight. Let me see if this is gonna work. Um, let me let me let me change my loadout right quick. So I think. Let's try this. Did it freeze it? No. Nope. Maybe I gotta freeze that, that, that lock up there. Hang on. Nope. Huh. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Um, it says push it. But can I get up to it? Can I get behind it? I don't know if I can get behind it or not. I don't know if I can. Can't destroy that stuff. Yeah, you're talking about this thing right here. Right up top, right? This guy right there that glows. I mean, we should try it. Left mouse click to handle. I need to stick something in there. Gate's open, but her, her dumb ass doesn't want to come inside. Akio? Uh, maybe. Uh, that's Akio, right? Yeah. We can try it. I mean, that's what, that's what, I mean, okay. Oh, shit. God dang it, boy. You knew all along, didn't you? This way. I will get the door. If you guys know something, let us know so we can get through this faster. That is the main keep. My guess is that we'll find Hollow and the letter inside. We'll need to be careful once we get. I hear them. Trolls. Yes. Restrain the beast. There we go. <laughs> Don't kill him. Wing. Do you know that hippogriff? Very well. New plan. I get the evidence and you free that hippogriff. Agreed? This is our chance. Go! Ah. Blast it! There's gotta be another way to get up to the roof. Somewhere. I hope Natty stays out of trouble. Up we go! Hmm. Wait, what? You go down? No, 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 no. Do I? I didn't do Le Le Guardian Le Le Leviosa, dude. <laughs> Not 
the safest place to sneak into. Oh shit. There we go. We learned something today, guys. Rebellion. Okay, time for new loadout. Hang tight. So, um, I like the uh, I like this almost as much as I like the other. But we got this back. These are all back to back. Let's go ahead and uh, let's change it up a little bit. We got. Um, I mean, in, let's see, not incendio. Oh, I don't use incendio. Wait, what? Expelliarmus. Configure. I don't use Incendio. Oh, we got to use Incendio. Yeah, 100%. And then these guys work together, so that's okay. That works. All right, cool. But I do need a... a so if I go up, there's that. And there. Okay, that's fine. Revenue. Got three wizards here. I have a different idea. Turn him into a chicken! Gotta go! I turned him into a chicken! I don't have a chicken problem. You have a chicken problem. Show myself. Oh dang it. It's pretty fast though, the cooldowns. That one hurt. Did hurt, a little bit. No! The fall! No! God dang it, man, I died! I fell off the damn ruin! Poop. Yeah, Natty's her name. Nettie, you recognize your name from somewhere? And by the way, is that that's not that's not Daniel Radcliffe? That's that's. I tried to repulse him off the battlements. It didn't work, James. I'm not. And I'm not. I'm not getting a testy with you. I'm like I'm frustrated because I tried, and you're right. I should. It should work. You should be able to just go boop 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 off the battlements. If it kills me, it should kill them. Hardcore parkour. Parkour parkour. No, oh, damn, not you. I know, right? Exactly. All right, we're going to try again. Not the safest place to sneak into. You're not going to notice me? 
Where did I set my traps? Was it lower Hogsfield or upper Hogsfield? Hmm, I don't know. What was it? Use this as a as a as a shield, though. This isn't a pass. Oh, I can! It let me. But every time I cast a spell, my just like D and D, my invisibility goes away, which is cool, I guess. It worked. Mandingo! Revelio. Here he comes. Get ready. Oh shit, I fucked up. Chicken man! I don't have a chicken problem, you have a chicken problem. I dream of making a Rebellion. I might be getting a little better at this, maybe. Revenue. One more. I thought. I thought there was one more. Do 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 do. I'm just sneaking. Hello, Hamora. Ha Nazis having an easier time of it. I don't have a level two lock. Revelio. Pick. Let's go up here and see what's up. I don't see any baddies. Going home in a wooden box. Am I? <laughs> I don't think so. You've done. Akio. Hey. I <laughs> just knocked him off the ledge. But that whole that whole smoke trick to get back where you were. Alohomora.
Take all the gold I can get. It's going to be a boss fight in about a two minutes. I think. Maybe. Natty should help me, though. I hope. Revenue. What's that? What's that for? Astrid, keep your eye on my stash, eh? It's yours if I mysteriously disappeared. That liar cheated us out of what was ours. So I took what I could and hit, hit, and hit it here. 20 damn years and treated no better than fools. We've been here for two blasted weeks. Wait, what? 20 damn years and treated no better than fools. Oh, than fools who have been here two blasted weeks. I get it. Okay. Revenue. I'm not meant to go there. Thief simulator? No. I'm just playing it like that, dude. You could walk right in and just start blasting if you want. Hi, Wing. Hi, Wing. Right. There we go. There you are. Let's go! Lohamora! Get on the damn hippogriff, lady! Oh, come on! <laughs> That's awesome! Express must be returning from an unscheduled run. Not gonna lie, it's pretty cool. So I'm using control to go down. Space doesn't go up. I wonder if anyone can see us from the castle. I'm not going that close to the water though. I don't know how to get him up. I'm just supposed it's to follow amazing. her. It's incredible, isn't it? I have a lot more stable than, than a broom. It won't let me go any faster. I just have to follow her. They want to show off their, their, their feathers. The developers did. I don't blame them. Looks pretty good. <laughs> How exciting. <laughs> it was exhilarating, wasn't it? I wasn't sure we were going to make it out alive. <laughs> there was no need to worry. I had it all under control. Were you able to find the letter? Summoned it straight out of Harlow's hands. <laughs> I will say, I did not expect to see him cast the killing curse at us. He won't forget this. Be on your guard. Of course. What did the letter say? That Rook was looking for a phoenix. <laughs> not a phoenix. sure where he will find one. But it also included Harlow's orders 
to inspect that castle for the poachers. Enough to connect Harlow to the crimes. I shall deliver the letter to Officer Singer. She'll have to do something when she sees it. Now, tell me, where did you meet these hippogriffs? I've only met Highway before. Poppy introduced us. Oh, Poppy right. Sweeting knows a hippogriff. <laughs> of course she does. Poppy will be relieved to know that Highway's safe. I came to the right person for help. My mother will be worried. I must go. Seek me out soon. I shall have much to tell you. When Sea Biscuit grew wings. Yep. All right, guys. Yee! Now. So uh, now, because I, if you have uh, uh, Caligo, is my is my dusk. Um, I think it's dusk or obsidian. I forget what it's called. Uh, uh, hippogriff. Yeah. When you have a moment, please stop by the room of requirement. Deke tells me he has something to share with you. There we go. So nobody's even even like sideways that I'm. They're walking by. You don't even you have anything to say that I'm on a hippogriff, right? 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 The one creature, one of the creatures that you would you would be like, oh my gosh, how my gosh, and he's not saying anything. Fine, let's go. Not bad, right? Okay, so control is down, space is up, and then left should get me in, in a sprint but it left click but it's not so shift is your is your uh, is your your speed now if I if I try to land whoa hang on maybe not maybe I don't land whoa what are these guys look at that bank look at that turn dude if they existed they might exist before I die. That'd be cool. I mean, you know, you, you, you hear about mythological beasts, and it makes me wonder, it makes me wonder if a previous society knew how to genetically manipulate animals and give them, uh, um, give them traits for different things. Like, we're trying to cure aging, right? Right now. But what if you could create a dragon? What if you could create a hippogriff? What if you could create a, a, a griffin? Um, you know, all, uh, uh, I mean, I mean, you know, a chimera would probably be confusing, but it's like having a two-headed snake or something, but only three heads. But dude, if they could create a, a pegasus, a flying horse, They'd make a. They'd make twenty-five trillion dollars. See if I can land. Okay, so it's not working. Let's go ahead and see if I can go down here. I may have to fast travel out of this. Wait, nope. He landed. And how do I dismount? B. Oh, I just hit B, and he disappeared. All right, hold down the tab key, and oh, here we go. So we've got this. Why, why can I? Okay, now we have to figure out how to use the. Uh, so if I want him back. I just do this. Hit tab and, and hit your whole tab and hit hit hit, uh, hit B or two. I mean, and then let's go. Up Come we go. on, I wing. There we go. Okay, cool, cool. Now if you got the uh, so control is going to let you land. Once he's landed, that's kind of slow, though. You hit B to get off. Oh, and you suck him back in your bag is what you do. I see. Okay, that's cool. They are. They are going to. They're going to. They are going to bring back the mammoth. Yeah, they are. Um. Okay. So let's go to journal. And I should be able in the collections. No, wait. Inventory. Oh, so this is it. High wings in my inventory then, and I have the, this Thestral here. So support. Oh, wait, beast can be added uh, t 
to vivariums. Oh, okay, so I'm gonna have to go and, and learn how to ride ride my, my, my Thestra. Right? Thestral. Alright, so go map. Oops. Secret rooms. Room requirement. Here we go. So why is it scary? Where is Neek? Deke would like to talk with you when you have a moment. Hello, Deke. Professor Weasley said you wanted to tell me more about the loom. Ah, hello. Uh, yes, about that. Deke has had a thought. He. Uh oh, here we go. Here we go. This is where the expansion happens. Ye mother freaking haw. Let's go. Seems the room thinks you need more space for your beasts. I got another uh, as Deke was saying. Uh, he's had a thought. Now, Deke knows how you can test the item of clothing that you enhanced in the enchanted loom. And uh, perhaps help an old friend in the process. What do you mean? A house elf named Tobbs works for his master, retrieving leech juice in a cave near Hogwarts. Tobbs master doesn't let him leave the cave. And Deke knows the cave is infested with spiders. That, that sounds awful. It is. Deke hasn't heard from his friend for a while now. As the item you wove in the loom has an enchantment that might be useful, Deke thought you could test it whilst checking on Tobbs. Yeah, I'll, I'll do it. I understand. Leave it to me, Deke. I'll find Tobbs for you. Oh, thank you. Please let Deke know what you learn about Deke's old friend. Okay. It warms my heart to see your interest in pathology, dare I say, blossom. Yeah, lady. Oh shit, my potions. Thought we were, they were gonna burn. <sighs> Oh, the chomping cabbage. All right, guys, hang on. We got to go out here, out here for a minute. I got to do something. Hang on. So I need to just give me a second. Um, where is it? I have to go buy a breeding pen. Not, not, not the toy box. I want to buy the breeding pen, but I also want to get. Hang on. The composter, maybe it's inside. Maybe the composter's inside. I need a composter too. Hang on, I, that's what I really need. So. Thinks you should be proud of all the potions you brewed. Yeah, 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 yeah sure. Um. Dung composter is purchased from tomes and scrolls so we're gonna go buy that and the yeah hang on we'll go up there in a minute I know you guys want to see it but I need this done and then um, I also need the breeding pen now that I have a new a vivarium I need to do that so tomes and scrolls is where we're going guys I'll be right back in a second. We're going to go to Tomes and Scrolls and Hogsmeade. All right, so here, there. How does he get his stringy hair to, to, uh, to stay straight like that? It is magic. It's a kind of magic. 
Off need, here I come. And you're welcome for that song in your head for the rest of the day. It's a kind of magic. Oh. Ah! You guys appeared out of nowhere, man. I was wondering when I'd see you again. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, here. Buy that. Those are the same. Those are better. That's better. That's better. That's better. Um, but not much better. So let's I'm gonna sell both these. I'll keep that one. Uh, wait. I'll sell this and, and keep those uh, those newt glasses. And then, I said we're gonna need a. You know, I'm, well, let's see how much money we've got left when I'm done. Dung composter because I need more. Nothing like finding just the right thing. Metal refiner. Use it to produce moonstone essential for additional. No, I don't need. I don't need a moonstone creator. I've got their moonstone is everywhere. Um. Wait, what? We're gonna hang on for a second here. Let me know if there's anything. Yeah. Else um. I can do to help. So dung composter. And then, what was the other thing I needed? Was a, um... Hang on. No, not Brood and Peck. You know what? I'm going to sell some stuff at Brood and Peck, though. Let's go there right quick. I got a couple things to sell. A couple of uh, uh, creatures that I, that I, 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 I caught. Sorry if there's a smell. New batch of toad hide. So I'm keeping my uh, because those are the, my, this is my breeding pair, and this is my breeding pair of puff skein. But I don't need the deer calls because I've got two more. So we're gonna sell that one. Sell this one. Cool, cool, cool. I'll not mind seeing you here again. Consider yourself welcome. What are you? A fooper? I don't I don't own a fooper. We gotta go get foopers, man. Revelio. Okay, so. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Um, I forgot what I was looking for. Let's go here. Nobody remember? Oh, oh, let's go. Auto run would be nice. Oh, this is a river. I need the bridge. Chet. I see you. Garnif, what's up, dude? Hello. Is something the matter? Most decidedly, yes. My precious moon calf, Biscuit, was abducted by poachers up north. 
vicious brutes. I tried to fight back, but I was no match for them. I'm sorry about your moon calf, Mr. Garnuff. Just Garnuff. I'm only one goblin. Not a particularly brave one at that. I have no chance against a pack of bloodthirsty poachers. Oh, my poor biscuit. I can only hope she's able to escape. Uh. Why do you suppose the poachers took Biscuit? I have no idea. Mooncalf dung's highly valuable for fertilizing magical plants. I cannot imagine poachers care much about gardening. Who knows what they'll do to her? She could be flog skinned, gutted, and stuffed. I assume. Oh, Biscuit. Okay. A moon calf is an unusual pet. Why did you choose Biscuit? She followed me one evening. I wouldn't leave my side. Never thought I was one for a pet of any kind. Now I can't imagine life without her. Moon calves are often thought of as silly, simple minded creatures. But I've seen great depth of character in Biscuit. I wouldn't trade her for a hippogriff or a hippopotamus. Or even a goose that lays golden eggs. I'll keep an eye out for your moon calf, Garneth. Oh, how kind. If only all of Wizard Kind was as gracious to goblins. If you do see her and can bring her safely home to me, I promise to reward you for your efforts. Don't mind that sound. Keep an eye out for her. And be careful out there. Poachers are an unscrupulous lot. Yeah, they are. I should try and rescue Garneth's moon calf. Sounds as if I'd need to head north to find those poachers. Yeah, but we're not going to do that right now. Um, what was the other thing I wanted? Welcome. The breeding pen. Let me know if I can be of any assistance at all. So the breeding pen should be... It should have been in the brooding pack, right? But it wasn't there. We're still headed up to the magic neat. Hang on. I'm gonna grab some fertilizer if I can. I need I need to like up my stuff. I mean we don't really need to, but I want to see what he has. Thank you, Roy. Appreciate you. Oh god, dang it, boy! I can't work fence. She's quiet. Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Yeah, fertilizer. Now you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. Uh, keeping those. Hang on. No one can say I don't keep a stack shelf. Um. Okay. So we're going back. Um. So I'm gonna do, I'm gonna drop this dung for the li this dung, this dung uh thing. Hogwarts map. Secret rooms. Requirement. And then we'll explore this uh this this new uh, vivarium that we got. It might unlock the breeding pen. I may not have the breeding pen available to me though, uh, right now until I get to this new vivarium, which is this this glass globe here. That's my second one, I think. So I think, I believe, I should be able to make. Oh, that's a breeding pen. You know what? Hang on a second, guys. We're going to have a little fun. That lofty tree looks fine, but I don't think I, I don't know if I like it. Let's go with the uh, uh, large tree cluster. Oh, that's nice. I like that a lot. I wanted to make a little uh, little kind of sanctuary thing. If I could, maybe we'll do that later. Maybe we'll, you know, we'll, 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 we'll work on the vivarium later on. I can rotate this. And then look at the budget total. I barely even scratched the surface, which is cool. So I think the dung might be inside. I think the mammoths could restore the permafrost. I mean, if you're going to do that, you may as well, you, you got to have, you got to have a full biome. Mammoths alone are not going to do the trick. 
which means uh, saber-toothed tigers and everything else. Alright, so... Here we go. Uh, sure, the scientific dunk, dunk composter. Where am I going to put this thing? Where am I going to put my poop? Right here. For now. Poop pot. Four minutes. Yay! But I have to come back and... and oh, it smells like shit in here. God dang it, man! It smells like poop in here. I can have three of them, so we're gonna have another one. Cause why not? And that, Cause this side didn't even open yet, right? Cool. Three at a pop. Love it. Wait, you know what though? Where's my pig? Where's my pig? I th oh, I haven't gone and gotten him yet. Wait. Four reels pl placards. What are the six rules? Can I read them? Guess not. <laughs> All right, here we go. This is a desert biome. Oh, it's a beach biome. Shut the hell up, man. It's a beach. Woohoo! We have a very own beach. You know what? Even though it's rocky and stuff, I kind of like it. Wow, man. All right, let's go ahead and we're going to let these little guys go because we can. So we're going to go with H. And we're going to let... Um, I'm going to go ahead and add these beasts to the vivarium. Tell me I got a male and, fe I got a male and female so, uh, 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 Thestral, yo. The floofs, they need to go back in the... In the we're going to put those in the forest, but not right now. And then I've got... Caligo is a male. Highwing's a female. Hello, I got a breeding pair <laughs> of each. I got them. Now, I got Caligo uh, because I um I or I was given the um the deluxe edition. So you can buy the deluxe edition and get this this, this dark skinned creature. Same with the the Thestral. Which is going to be uh, Sepulchra. Sepulchra. Let's go ahead and get some. Uh, and we got to feed these guys. Um, let's go ahead and go here. Feeding station. Everybody get fed, yeah. Oh, you're getting stuck in the sand, aren't you, little guys? I'm so sorry. Here, if I brush your fur, will that make you feel better? Maybe. What the hell? Where'd you come from? Did I have those? Oh, I did drop the drop, drop, didn't I? Whoa, whoa, shit. Let's see here. Uh, I can collect that. I can collect a, uh, a, uh, a high wing feather. Uh, I can collect this feather. Everybody's nurtured, which should be good. All right, we got about 20, 30 minutes. 
You know what though? I kind of feel like I want to flip these guys out. Let's put the frogs in here, yeah? Let's pull these guys. Move these, fl these floofs no. and the, and the, uh, the jobber nulls. And we will come back with uh, two different um, species. I'm going to flip them. Come on. Come on. There we go. Um, we're going to pull the toads. There, there. Not good and the hide. dodos. And then we'll put the floofs in. The puff skeins. And the jobber nulls. For now. Those are my four species here. Don't uh oh me. Cute little bastard. Throw the purple toads in here. We have eight out of the 13 species right now. So next is unicorns and something else. This is guys to fly over the ocean. That's cool. All right. And, uh,. Now that looks more like it, right? The dodos will enjoy the beach. The frogs will definitely enjoy the water. These guys can fly up on the cliffs. You can feel safe and you should be good. Am I correct? I think I'm correct. It doesn't matter, guys. You can put them wherever you want. It doesn't really matter. They're all happy now. This is cool. What is that? Th what, what, why, why does that thing have a, a wookie head with legs? What thing? What are you talking about? I can't do a Wookiee voice. I never could. However, Rebellion. we probably have a bunch of stuff up in here. There's a path. See? Materials, yo. Rebellion. There should be a hidden cave, too. There wasn't the other one. It has stuff in it. That's a chest. Oops. A little arch. I can make a low arch. Oh! Oh, 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 Amy, Amy, you can let your... <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. Amy's talking about the, uh, the Hufflepuff, the, the, the Pufflebutt. I forget what it's called. Puff skin. A puff skin. Uh, all right. So we have eight different species now. So all this is going to open up. You see that highlight? See that highlight? All this stuff is going to open up later. I don't know about this. I don't think it will. Um, that's going to open up too. All this stuff is going to open up eventually, I think. This is going to be a huge area. Are we good? Are we good? Are we good? Is it time? Uh, pick up that fertilizer. Yeah, I'm right. I'm proud of my potions, man. Inspect, add fertilizer. Inspect, add fertilizer. It's going to double the amount I'm going to get from these guys. And these are the most damaging stuff in the game, I think. Pretty sure. Cabbages. I'm going to go ahead and do... We're going to do fertilizer and cabbages time around. Cabbages, they go after your enemies, which is really cool. I haven't shown you this stuff either. Um, I've been playing with it, but I haven't shown you guys. Uh, give me my mandrake. My tool wheel slots are full. How many? Oh, I'm out? Oh, no. Okay. It's a Wookiee head, I'm telling you. Because mark the area on your map. Hang on, I, Deke has marked the area on your map, yeah. You're talking about the, um, the puff skeins. You know, they're, they're, tri they're, tri they're, they're tribbles, man, with eyeballs. You know, from Star Trek. If you're not old enough to remember the tribble episode from Star Trek, I mean, you can go back and watch it on, on, on YouTube, probably. I 
Oh, we need some beast care working here. Hang tight. I really wonder to see how this is closed. And that one's empty. It's just being filled right now because I came in. This one is, is empty. Uh, this one's been cl closed because it's empty. I'm wondering if these guys get, can starve to death. Uh, what do we want? Brush? You know what? Since I'm coming in here... Hang on. Do a different loadout. Since I'm coming in here... And I'm doing this all the time. We're gonna we're gonna put the brush here. The food. I don't think I'm, the food can stand four. It's fine. Uh, but I do need that to be number two, and this to be number three. No, that's number four. Number three. There we go. So this is uh, that way. I, I can brush. Then I can make things if I need to. I can get rid of things if I need to, or change them. That's funny, James. James knows what I'm talking about. That's hilarious. All right, so we got our, our mount, guys. Okay. What's this going on here? I don't really need this uh, this stuff right now. I just want to have it if I need it. You know what I mean? See, this stuff was not here before. These lace wing flies, they grew back. Which means we've got stuff in here I gotta get, uh, go, I can go gather, maybe. Uh, yep, sure enough, look at this. These guys don't show up very often, but when they do, it's a really nice bonus little treat. Is because the hook lump juice is really rare, dude. Is that ch is that chest closed? No, it's open. So the chests are a one-off, but that cave will give you hook lump juice, which is really nice. And um, Rebellion. what else? Guys, wh this is uh, of course I got these eggs. Rebellio makes it easier though. I don't need that, but it's nice to have it. That's already opened. Now let's get out of here. If Tribbles, Wookies, Ewoks, Gizmos, and Furbies are all the same species. Maybe. All right. I don't have enough Mandrake, dude. It's so good. Hang on, we're gonna wait for this, and then uh, so I have all, all the fertilizer. Actually, I don't need it. I kind of want it though, so I have a double batch next time. Come on, let it up. Oh, can I not get any more? Come on, there it is. So, what did you say, bud? Where is he? Where's that little house elf at? Where is he? It warms my Let me talk to Weasley right quick, see what's up. There, I, say. I have some questions about alteration, Professor. Yes? Thank you, Professor. I Guess have not. no more questions. I'll be here if you need anything else. Let's go journal real quick and see what's up. Um, I have to attend an astronomy class. What? Wait, take the biscuit. What's this? Garnet to the poacher camp was north of Hogmeads. I should start looking there. 
Find the poetry camp where biscuit is held. Oh, that's for that goblin. Yeah, no, we're gonna wait on that. I'm gonna I'm gonna do all these uh, these these side quests, but. Profe oh, okay, hang on a second. Professor Weasley wanted me to use an altering spell. Hang on. Oh, that's why. Who said that? That was Melora yesterday. Or There's some other of you in the chat were saying that I, I didn't do everything she wanted me to do, and I missed this, the rest of the side quest. Alter the style of an item and adjust the size of an item. Let's do that. Hang tight. Let's do that real quick. Because then it might unlock more stuff. Oh, my God. I'm so... Okay, sometimes I'm a little dense. I get it. All right? Don't call me on it because I'll get mad. But... Okay, so we're going to go ahead and I'm going to... 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 Do this. And we're... No, wait. That's not it. I'm going to change. No, not that. Do the rug, I guess. There's a lot of stuff in here now. Nope. I mean, I guess it didn't matter. I can just change the color, right? And we'll go black. Style and there it is. So change the style of this rug. Cool. And change the size of the rug. Amy Petty coming in with a super chat. I don't often get to contribute directly to the channel, but this week I can. Thanks for reviewing this game. Amy, don't thank me. Thanks, Pickle Lil. She bought this game for me, and so I got it for free. And one, one of our one of our very, very valued, uh, you all are valued, obviously, but one of my valued mods uh, just flat out just gave me the game because I said I was going to buy it. I was going to buy it no matter what. And she said, here, let me go ahead and gift that to you. And if you'll just play it, I'd appreciate it. Now, now do not think. By the way, thank you again, Amy, for that super chat. Um... I was going to buy this already. I said I was going to buy this already. Do not think just because you buy me a game that I'm going to play it because then you'll be disappointed. I don't want that to happen. It hurts my feelings when I hurt your feelings, and I don't mean to. Like, Tui's still here. I yelled at him the other day because because uh, I was frustrated. And I didn't. I, I took it out on him for no reason. Like, I'm a dumbass, I, and I apologized, and he's still here. So, I mean, you know, I mean, you get my point. Okay, I don't change the color. I want to change the size. Z and X change the size. Ooh, it's tiny. Wait. Okay. Make it a tiny, tiny rug. Tiny rug. Nicely done. Now you're ready for something a little more advanced. You can use the altering spell directly on the room's architecture. Try these new designs on the floor or balcony. Balcony or the floor of the room? That's what I'm trying to do. It won't let me. Hang on. How about the balcony? We'll try the balcony. It happens usual. I think most of us are re uh, reasonable enough to understand that sometimes uh, people can get un unintentionally snappy when they're frustrated and tired. That and I, I don't, I don't, I don't play RPGs very often. So that Amy, so that that's a big deal too. It's like, you know, I mean, a lot of people who play RPGs all the time, they understand how the quests are laid out. Not me. I'm a guy who does the survival games for the most part. You know, so this is new to me. I mean, it's not new to me, but, you know, it is kind of a new thing, you know, for the channel. So to be doing it regularly. So, yeah, I'm enjoying myself, though, and I'll get better, and I'll get better with my temperament, too. So let's go ahead and go here. Boop. 
Change the color of the balcony. And apply that. Confirm. I did peach. Wanted to brighten the room up a little bit. Yeah, okay, so. Oh, I see. Oh, I like that. Do that. Of course, Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley showed Deke this bit of magic some years ago. Deke thinks you'll enjoy it. Uh, come and talk to Deke when you're ready. Professor Weasley said I should ask you about changing the room's ambience? Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? Um, natural and earthy. I like the room to feel natural and earthy, as though I'm outdoors. Oh, sounds perfect. Oh, I'd love the shit out of this. This is amazing. Look at it. I love it. And we got leaves falling. Hmm. Quite a difference. I got a, a sun. Of course, I, you needn't keep this style if you don't like it. You can always ask Deke to change it back. Now you have learned a good bit about alteration. Thank you, Professor. The room is full of possibilities. Indeed. No matter how much time I spend here, the room always manages to surprise me. Cool, man. Uh-oh. Oh, do we get our third one? No. -uh. Oh, wait, what is this? A library? Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. Here we go. Give me something good. An even bigger space. How did that happen? The room equips itself to your needs. It must have sensed that you needed more space to practice spell casting. If you'd like to customize the space further, you can use these spell crafts. You'll find more of them both inside and outside the school. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep an eye out. Good. I'll leave you to it. This is your space now. Use it wisely. Oh, she leaving? Oh, I had her here forever and now she's gone. She was my prisoner. And you guys made me let her go. What's wrong with you people? I was hot for teacher and now she's le she left me. Oh. <laughs> Let's go check out our new space, guys. This is cool. Look at see all the stuff that's gonna open up again in the future. I don't know about we can alter all this, I guess. You better not be looking at me. Oh, you are. Ah, they're looking at me. All the pictures. They're staring at me. Somebody's watching. Should I let them in? Lord, it's a devil. And would you look at him? You know the song. Uh, okay. They're the same pictures. I'm going to get rid of you. Maybe not now. Maybe later. It is a suite of requirements. Dude, it's becoming... i got to move all this stuff into a different room, though. Because, I mean... This poop smells like poop. Dick thinks you should be proud of all the potions you put. What's up, Dick? What did you need me to do, Deke? Deke's friend, Tobbs, collects leech juice from a spider-infested cave near Hogwarts. But Deke hasn't heard from Tobbs in a while. Right. As the item you wove in the loom has an enchantment that might be useful, Deke thought you could test it whilst checking on Tobbs. Oh, I can totally get rid of that picture, Holly, uh, these pictures, Holly. I just want to get rid of the duplicates. It'd be nice to have, you know, some of the pictures, but... We'll do that later. All right, let's go ahead and um, give me one second here. I gotta look something up right quick. 
Um, just bear with me. Bear with me, guys. I apologize. Seems like a fairly common question. Um, I'm looking how to access the deluxe content right quick. Um, okay, I should be able to assign it to be my, my primary mount, the Thestral. So let's go outside right quick. Let's go to the, uh, hang on, the world map. Um, I haven't frozen, by the way. We're almost like four hours in, and I haven't frozen not once today, which is great. I think. Uh, the, uh, by the way, if you ever if you have OBS and your and your your live stream is freezing, it seems like the uh, the way to fix that is to delete all of your sources and scenes, and create new scenes and new sources. Uh, that I mean that that worked for me. So let's go. I don't want to go to the Fidbit. Mooncalf Den's fine, I guess. It'd be cool to have nature pictures. It would be, yeah. I'm just like I'm like an older, a grumpy older brother that likes to give uh, Indian arm burns or, or nuggies. Yeah, no, dude. By the way, guys, hang on. I'm gonna pause this right quick. We're gonna address this right fast. I, I snapped at Tui. Tui Tombs, if you don't know, guys, has been a um, been a staunch supporter of the channel for a very long time. Um, matter of fact, um, I am opening up the uh, the uh, the field for new uh, new um, new uh, moderators for my uh, YouTube, my Twitch, and my Discord coming um, in March. I'm going to discuss it with my current mods and see how many slots we feel like we need to have available. And um, so I'm going to have a limited amount of slots. If anybody is wanting to, and if you've been around for a long time, like I see a lot of names that are here all the time, um, I, I would appreciate it if you've been around for more than a year before you try to apply because if I, because I mean, at least people will know who you are and they recognize you. If you, if you, if you, I, I, application, it's fucking, that's a stupid word because uh, it, what it is, is it's just me. Hey, I know you, you want to help out. You've been helpful. And, and so uh, I'm more than happy to have you on the team. And then, and then we'll talk about what, what, what the, what, what it means to be a moderator here uh, in March. So, I got to talk to my other moderators first. We have a lot of moderators, but I need more because I always want more because uh, because when people have to work or go do other things, um, well, then the other moderators can step in and help. OK, there are there are there are rules and there are limitations and there are things that that need to and not to happen. But if you're interested in March, I will be uh, letting everybody know next month that uh, about the moder moderations uh, um, uh, situation. I'm also going to be starting a new channel in April, so that's why I need more people as well. So, that's why I'm trying to double up. We have a lot now, but I need more. So, anyway, so anyway, that's what I'm saying. And if you love me, then that's why you're where you'll be. I'm just kidding. I'm not going to do that to you. All right, so, I wanted to come out here to hold down tab and see if I, why can I not get the Thestral? Wait, hang on. I don't want you because I need to access. Oh, hang on. Go to, on the loadout menu. Go to, go to a gear piece you want to change. No, 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 send it. Hang on. I got to find my Thestral because I, oh, oh, Halo. Uh, high keep. One moment, please. I unlock. Okay, so I'm. I, I, I we pre-ordered the game, and we got the the uh, the the deluxe edition. 
So for some reason, it's not letting me. I don't know why it's not letting me. All right, well, I'm going to edit this then. We're going to change this to mount and get rid of Thestral because until I figure it out, I'm not going to falsely advertise. You know what I mean? All right. We'll worry about that later. I don't really care about this guy because I think I might need a new, a new broom. Hiling, go! Real quick, let me go ahead and uh, let me pop up chat again. If I don't, I won't be able to read what you're saying. Oops, hello. Nighttime. This really sounds like Harry Potter, like a lot. By the way, if you do Revelio while you're in the air, you see all the icons. What beast do we have over here? Does Deluxe have DLC? I mean, yeah, I'm supposed to be able to get uh, 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 the Onyx um, Hippogriff and the Thestral and all the Dark Arts stuff, too. This is faster than my broom right now. Slow down now. There we go. <laughs> you know that Hippogriff is like, oh my god, he's going to suck me back in the bag again. It sucks. Ah! Revelio. Are these puff skeins? Oh, puff skeins. Yeah, I don't. I don't care about puff skeins. I was just looking. All right, let's go ahead and see a uh, journal right quick. Now that we have that uh, ast astronomy class, I guess. Sure, let's go. Since we haven't frozen not once, I want to kind of play some more, guys. I kind of like this game a lot. A lot. But we will be stopping here in a minute, uh, probably in a few minutes, so I can go ahead and take a quick break, because four hours is probably good enough. And then I'll come back in 30 minutes and we'll play again. I'm going to grab something to eat. I'm hungry. Gotta make myself some dinner. And your reading is the dragon. That's exciting, I suppose. Perhaps you're due for an adventure. I am the dragon. Ladies, Professor Shah, astronomy is not divination. You won't find the mysteries of the cosmos charted out on your palms or at the bottom of your teacups. Alas, the heavens remain hazy to the starry eyed. Now, if you were to devote yourselves to persistent and painstaking observation, you just might catch a glimpse. Or maybe With that in mind, yep. <laughs> please take your telescopes. Tonight, we will be on the observation deck. Looking for Elon Musk. That was my point. I was going to do an accent, but it just seemed inappropriate. Sneaking. Still sneak in. have your own. You can't be the new student forever, you know. You can share with Mr. Takar. Get out of my way, boy. Here, I, I wear my that. sunglasses no, no, at night. Focus on your own. So I can, so I can see. Okay. Now I expect all of you to put in your stargazing hours outside of glass. Is that clear? But professor, it's freezing out. Mere cold didn't stop the great stargazers of the past. Look only to the astronomy tables they erected throughout the highlands from which they gazed millennia ago on the very uh, self-same uh, uh, stars. She said above erected. 
Is that clear? <sighs> Dismissed. Cole didn't bother her, man. Dude, that's amazing. Oh, uh, hello. Good to see you again. We Ravenclaws must stick together. <laughs> oh, hello, Armit. Nice to see you again. Did I hear Professor Shaw say that you don't have your own telescope? I have a spare one you could borrow for the rest of term. Uh... I can't do that, Armit. You might need it. No, really, you can. And I won't. It's my old one. I finally got my hands on the new Celestia Contemplor. You've heard of it, I assume? No. I mean, of course you have. Sure. It's only the pinnacle of all personal stargazing implements. But my old model's not too shabby either. Goblin cut glass, first rate optical enchantments. Hate to think such a fine instrument is just collecting dust. Well, I. I thank you, Amit. Think nothing of it. Anyway, the telescope's in the storage room right underneath us. You can't miss it. I have some, uh. Reading to finish on the lower deck. Come find me there afterwards and bring the telescope. There's something I want to talk to you about. Whoa, whoa, whoa! You have some reading to uh uh to do later down the, uh, down below. And bring the telescope because I want to talk to you about something. What what do you want me to look at, yo? Weirdo. I don't know, man. Finish your reading before I get back. This was his old telescope. <laughs> Looks practically brand new. What is this? Oh, my bad. There it is. Revelio. So he gave me a a pristine night for stars. Professor Shaw. I'm interested in learning more about astronomy. It is increasingly rare to find a student who seeks after things celestial of their own accord. But if you truly desire to chart the courses of the cosmos, you must rid your mind of the terrestrial babble of others. We ourselves are not unlike blank star charts, you know? Empty canvases waiting to be inscribed with all that the universe has to offer. Do you understand? Okay, stop. This woman, this voice actor, is this um, uh, the one that was in Critical Role and um, played, uh, what's her name, Fiery, and then also was in Ms. Marvel, the TV series, uh, well, the, the, the HBO series, um, I mean the Disney Plus series. Um, she was the auntie. What actress is that? Is that her? You mentioned astronomy tables earlier, in class. What were you talking about? Long ago, devotees of the astral arts set up stone slabs across the countryside. They are ideal for studying constellations near and far. For centuries, wizards made use of these astronomy tables for stargazing. Sadly, they have since become mere monuments to the intrepid intellectual pursuits of a bygone epoch. Okay. Am I right in thinking you are unimpressed by divination? Of the many other so-called disciplines taught here, divination is perhaps the most feeble, especially in its nonsensical practice of astrology. Do not confuse astronomy and astrology. One is concerned with mysteries stellar and lunar, the other is mere lunacy. Yeah, I mean, we don't really know what's going on, so come on. Thank you, Professor. I look forward to stargazing. I am glad to hear it. Should be a stellar night for it. Oh, look, there's Brad Pitt. Oh, look, Matthew Damon. Oh, look, Tom Cruise. Hmm. Professor Shah's just about as cold and distant as the bloody stars she wants us to chart. Ugh, not how I wanted to spend my evening. Not sure what you can learn from these astronomy tables that you can't learn from a cup of tea leaves. No, no, James, you don't know. I, I, okay, um, I'm talking about, um, it was the uh, Exandria Unlimited series that he did. It was like, like four or five episodes where Matthew Mercer actually played a character. That's what I'm talking about. 
Fiery Rye or something like that. I forget her name. Her character's name. She was a Fire Genasi. I am a big Critical Role fan. I've seen all the episodes twice. So, um, it does sound like her. <laughs> I forget her name, though. Deny. Is her name Deny? I forget. I'll, I'll, I'll figure it out. The constellations are beautiful. I'm not sure they're worth dying of a cold for, but they are beautiful. Oh, couldn't push him off the edge. We're living on the edge. The perfect night for... I have the telescope. It's nicer than I'd expected. I would not offer a prospective stargazer a third-rate... Fiora Rye. <laughs> That's her name. But what's the actress's but name, there is, James? there um, is something else. Yes, what is it? You remember those astronomy tables Shaw was going on about? It just so happens I've been reading up on them a little myself. And it seems there may be one right here at Hogwarts. I believe we could use it to find hidden constellations. Ah, I had a feeling there would be a catch to that telescope. Yep. No, no. I, I certainly wasn't trying to bribe you. Don't you don't get anything, anything for free, dude. But are you in? No one from the Gobstones Club will go with me. Said they'd rather get spit at by a stone than... Well, they are cowards. Let us get moving while are the you stars in? are still out. I've never I'll had anybody ask me that before. Get there. I promise. All right, I suppose I can go with you. I hope it's worth it. It will be. Trust me, I have read practically everything there is to read about this. It should be brilliant. Shall we? Don't worry about it, James. It's all good. Hang tight. The table is on a castle wall ahead. Look for a stone platform. Something that doesn't quite belong. We I'm found one of these see. before a couple days ago, and I was like, then? what is this about? So let's go find out, I guess. The only reason I'm following this kid Lumos. is because of that... Some say the locations of the tables were originally marked by centaurs for ritual stargazing. Where's my Lumos? Huh. It is nice having a fellow stargazer to explore with. Hey, Happy I... to be here. It is good to leave the classroom now and then. It's not that creepy out here at night, is it? The Gobstones Club are coward. Here I am. Charging ahead. Uh, why don't you lead the way? Sure. sure. Hmm. A little Rebellion. Bit. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Oh, of course. It's just not as... Hang tight. More cobwebs. You don't think any spiders might be lurking about? Well, I'm sure they are, oh, no. kid. Not this close to school, I mean. Rebellion. Hmm. Okay. Here we go. Look, there's a table. I think you should do the honors. Go on, try it out. Okay. Amit, could I ask you something? Oh, um, certainly. Why are you so fascinated with stars? I suppose because there is so much to learn about them. I mean, there is plenty to learn about a lot of subjects, but astronomy seems limitless. Always something new being discovered. They are forever discovering new moons and stars. In fact, they discovered a new planet just 50 years ago. Actually, that's all I wanted to know. Oh, very well then. <laughs> 
how do I use this? Rebellion. There it is. Oh, you need a telescope. Appear near the center of your view. Sure. I mean. As soon as you've lined up the telescope, we will be able to fill out our star chart. Oh, I see. Stargazing is all about patience and precision. Yeah, I get you. I see it. Bear with me. I think maybe. What? That goes there. Um, wow, guys. Really? It is nearly impossible to contain your excitement at a moment like this. Keep steady. Gentle adjustments. No. This is a freaking stupid mechanic. Wait, what? Zoom? Oh. God dang it, man. Come on, really? Thank you, John. Appreciate you, man. That's dumb. I mean, not really dumb, but it's it's it, frustrating. Uh, so we rotate again. I get it now. Okay. Dude, come on. I was right about the tables. They really are gateways to the far stars, just as the book said. What are you going to give and me? Your contribution was invaluable. Rest assured, you shall be credited in my memoirs one day. Thank you, Amit. I look forward to reading them. And I look forward to writing them. <laughs> this is only the beginning. You will find more tables like this one throughout the grounds and forest. Yeah, I found All them. beckoning to be discovered by a worthy astronomer. And if I have ever seen one, it's you. Oh, and about my old telescope. Don't bother returning it. You should keep it. That's quite generous. Thank you. You are welcome. It has goblin cut glass and a gobbledygook inscription. I'm practically fluent in gobbledygook, you know. It's all in the throat, really, gobbledygook, you know, and, and how you pronounce your R's. Um, anyway, glad our adventure was a success. I will see you soon. By the way, speaking of gobbledygook, I, Monogard told me that, I, I told Monogard this just joke the, uh, yesterday and she didn't get it. Did you guys know that Yoda has <sighs> a, uh... Um, Never do get tired of seeing the astronomy tower at night. What a view. Hang tight. Wait for the game to fi finish. I have there it is. Who is being harassed by Halo. He may be able to provide the evidence we need to take Halo down. We should speak with him together. Meet me at his home. Okay, so, by the way, so did you guys know that Yoda... Oh, fuck you. you really? Why don't we meet at the map chamber to discuss that and our next steps? Okay. we Will do. Anybody else? Want to interrupt me while I'm speaking? Alright, anyway. It was just a joke. Yoda has a last name. Did you guys know what the Yoda's last name was? Lehihu. Yodelay hee hoo. 
And that's where I'm going to end this episode, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to go ahead and let it go. Um, but I will be back in 30 minutes. We're going to play another three or four hours. Um, how rude of them. I know, right? Yes. Yoda Lehihu. We're going to go ahead and end this. And I'm going to get something to eat. We'll give it 30 minutes at 4.30. I will know. Well, maybe 445. We will start again. We'll keep playing. Aha! It was a good joke, right? Dad joke. I love, I love it. That was great. I can't take credit. I saw it on the internet. So, anyway, guys, as I always say, I am my usual me. You be your usual you. Hopefully, this, this Hippogriff Mount uh, video was helpful to somebody. If it was, <laughs> don't forget to hit that bell icon for notifications. And we'll see you later. I'll see you in 30 minutes, guys. Bye-bye. Knowing a meat, he's likely stunned.